Uh, hold on a second. I'm not gonna appear for a second. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Give it a second. Yeah, there we go. I forgot to do a few things, actually, before I went live. Like make my captions readable. That is always a good idea. There we go. Captions are now readable. They're not a part of the darkness. Thank goodness. Music is a go. Maybe not. Yes, no, there we go. Music is a go. Ad break is in progress. That's okay. That's kind of just, that's how it goes. That's how it goes, baby girl. Um, and then yeah, I think everything's good. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the stream. How are we today? Hello, Kyle. Hello, Mango. Hello, Sidra Kiro. I, I know who you are. I promise. I just don't know how to read English. Anyways. Oh, also, hi, Kezrin. Thank you for that hydration check. I will do that right now. Grabbing the water, which was placed almost behind me again. I need to stop placing my water bottles semi-behind me to where I cannot reach them while I'm live. I just remembered something. I remembered one more thing I didn't do. My alerts are muted. Hold on. Run. Ah! It's terrifying. I'm running. I'm running. My alerts are muted. I'm running. I'm sprinting. I'm chasing. I'm going. Alert box. Alert box. Boom! Unmuted. Alright, we're in the clear now, everybody. The alert boxes will make sounds. Wow! It was about to be a very silent stream. Anyways. Hello, Sky Alpha. Welcome on in. I'm good. Today on the way home on the bus, it was so packed. You couldn't fit a baby between two people. And I was squished by like six women. Hot women. So it was super awkward. <laughs> See, for me, I just think I'd be awkward because people, humans... Ah, this is why buses terrify me. It's not because of the hot women. It's just because of the people in general. Just human beings in general give me slight amounts of, of terror and um, concern. You know, you know how it be. But I'm glad you survived. Welcome back from the ads. I hope the ads treated you guys well. Oh, guys, I finished. Um, So I honestly thought that today's stream was going to be me working on the spellbound thumbnail. Oh, I never drank my water. Hold on. I was holding it in my hands with the lid off and just wasn't drinking it. I was just talking, just talking away. Anyways, um, I really thought today's stream was going to be me working on the next Spellbound thumbnail because I didn't think I'd get it done. But then I got it done. And y'all, if you haven't seen it, if you haven't seen it, it's good. It's really good. In fact, I'm going to switch us over really fast. Because I already have it pulled up on my drawing program just to show it off because it's good! Look at it, guys. Ignore the little mountain gear things that popped up for a second. Look at it! She's horrified. I'm actually really proud of her expression. I, I, I think I did really good, you guys. She looks horrified. She will probably never be the same. She looks like she will never recover from what she has experienced. Also, her hair is really nice. It's a shame that her hair was braided by a demon, but you know, sometimes to get a good haircut, you gotta let a demon do it. I, apparently. Uh, if there's one thing that Spellbound has taught me, it's that although demons usually aren't great, they do know how to braid hair. And that is kind of nice. Um, the rest of it's not so nice. It, it's mostly pretty bad, but really good hairstylists, those ones. It's probably because they've been around for who freaking knows how long. Probably, probably a very long time. Let's face it. I guess it's, I guess it makes sense. I am sorry, but Goldie looks like a pineapple with the green and orange color. She's not a pineapple. <laughs> Why would you say that? She's nothing like a pineapple. How dare you? I do have to say, though, Goldie looks good in green. We have to admit it. Like, I've always dressed Goldie in green clothes. Like, even before season two, let me pull up a season one drawing of Goldie. Season one Goldie also wore green. Where is it? To be fair, Olive also wore green. Hold on, we're just pulling up all the characters now. Okay, so SB Olive, she wore green, all right? She wore green. She dies, and then SB Goldie. SB Goldie, I don't need to say that. Goldie is the only Goldie there is. And then Goldie comes around, 
And Goldie is over here. Where is a good drawing? Where is a good drawing of her uh, hoodie? Why do I not have any good drawings of her in her hoodie? Excuse me? Excuse me? Oh, wait, this works. Ignore that this is angsty. She's also wearing green as a child, all right? Ignore that that's angsty and sad, all right? I couldn't find a good one. To be fair, Goldie did go through a phase where she wasn't wearing green, okay? But also, to be fair, she wasn't wearing green because she was basically dressing up exactly like her mother. She was basically copying her mom. She was going through her angsty kid phase as well. And then she went directly back into- oopsies. Directly back into green. And, you know, now the demon has green. So I think this- everything here is just accumulating into the moral of the story is Goldie looks gosh darn good in green. And demon- demon deals with the demons are bad, but if it turns you green and green suits you, that's not too horrible. Um, <laughs> imagine, like, a demon makes a deal with you and you're like, I don't know, what color is my eye gonna turn into if I make a deal with you? Green. <gasps> green looks good on me. Yeah, go for it. Like, what if you made a deal with a demon based off of the freaking eye color you get from it? I'm sorry, your deal sounds really nice, however- However, I don't think, I don't think yellow would suit me, um, so I'm gonna pass. <laughs> Spell Spellbound, but the demon's color was yellow and everyone went, eh. Nah. Nah. I'll pass on that. Anyways, sorry, I'm trying to get this blanket to stay on my shoulders. It's trying to fall off and it's really bugging me because I'm cold. Come on, blanket. There we go. That's better. Sorry, I was having a little bit of a battle. Anyways... As Fiala wore green, baby Goldie wore green, young, still ch child Goldie. Okay, hold on. As Olive, baby Goldie, girl, you you have a nasty look on your face. Calm down. I get it, you're traumatized. Chill out. I don't even draw your face pattern like that anymore. That's aged. I stopped drawing the... I stopped drawing the little line that went this way with her orange markings. It was just bugging me. It never quite looked right. And the reason I drew it that way is because I was mimicking, um... SB Olive Scar here, but I feel like just drawing the underneath mimicked it well enough. I can see Goldie walk up to a demon and make a deal with a demon. Goldie has made a deal with a demon! She just thought it was her mom at the time! It was a pinky promise, but little did she know it was a little bit more than just a pinky promise. Anyways, I'm gonna close these now. Anyways, yeah. She made a deal, um, but she didn't know. She was like, oh, what a nice little pinky promise, right? 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 No. It was- it was not. It was, um, nice green ponytail holder as well. Shocking, am I right? I did sketch this after the Spellbound stream, by the way. I feel so bad for Goldie. Girly Pop is going through it. But she has a nice hairstyle now. So, you know... You win some, you lose, uh, a lot others. Here, I'm gonna do the quickest little doodle ever on the screen, because I need to open my LaCroix, and I don't want you guys to be staring into the, into the void. There you go. This is too- uh, this is so that you guys don't stare into the void while I crack open a LaCroix. I don't know. It wasn't necessary, but I did it anyways. LaCroix time! There we go. There we go. Anyways, I'm a little upsetty spaghetti. I got too busy yesterday to call my Wi-Fi company, but they are most definitely messing with our Wi-Fi. Because I had to downgrade my stream quality twice. Um, so I need to call them. And I was going to call them yesterday, but guess who got super busy with work and school? Me! So I'll probably call them if they're still freaking going to answer me later today. Stream should be fine. It's just that I had to downgrade quality a little bit. Not a whole bunch, but it's just that I keep having to downgrade it bit by bit every stream. And I'm like, I'm not going to keep downgrading my stuff. Y'all make my internet work. So fingers crossed chat that I can call them and they'll pick up and fix whatever they did wrong. <laughs> or maybe next stream it's just going to be really crunchy. <laughs> going to keep crunchifying the stream as time goes on. I'm currently drawing uh, a fursona with some of the outline. Ooh! I hope it is treating you well. 
I know, uh, freaking muzzles are hard to draw. And I know that I should probably be good at drawing muzzles by now, but I'm not. I'm just not. All right. I sipped on my LaCroix. I'm filled with joy. I need to figure out... People are talking to me. Hold on. Sorry. I, I, I had a commission I finished recently and sent over to the commissioner, and I just need to make sure it's good. Okay. Yay! Um... <laughs> All right. All right. Life is good. Life is great. Who do we appreciate? Now, I need to decide what I want to draw today. That's always the hard part. If I had done the thumbnail, we would have known what I was drawing. But now we have to figure out what I'm drawing. Slowly, all of streams go back to early YouTube graphics. As much as I would hate the bad quality, I would also, like, crack up at watching my streams, like, day by day become more and more crunchy because <laughs> i keep having to like just go down like quality level bit by bit every stream until my wi-fi company will finally fix whatever the heck they did um you know what i want to do actually um i want to draw sp term in his mask but i don't know if i have a i'm gonna ask term a question uh do you have a pick Sure of SB term and his mask question mark like Minecraft skin wise We'll see if that gets me anything because I could try it from memory, but I don't freaking know what that looked like That was creepy by the way. Why why did you have to keep popping up out of the void wearing the mask? Everyone's like, oh, I love that mask figure Hey, it's so good to see you, masked figure! What you doing in the void? Y'all, imagine living your life- Here, let me put my LaCroix down, actually. I'll- I'll- I'll grab my, um, draw and stuff. Imagine living your life, and you just hear the voice of a man, and then all of a sudden- all of a sudden, the- the man with this creepy mask appears in front of you. That would be horrific! I hope we all agree that that would be absolutely terrifying. La -da 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 -da. Hello there. Ah! <laughs> I would not be the same. I might just Google what this mask looked like. Because it, it was, um, what was it? It was, I wonder if it was the magic mod. Hold on. I'm gonna see if I can Google what this mask looks like, but I don't know which mod pack it came from. Um, Minecraft mod. I don't know what mod pack it comes from, legitimately, so I don't know how to Google it. I just got- is it just straight up the Majora's mask? I think it is. That's what it looks like. Well, I guess I'll just reference this mask. Um, alright, that's exciting. Let me, um, put this on my other screen real quick. Somewhere in the corner. Alright, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Um, Olive! Welcome on in! How you doing? We got the gills. We got the gills, everybody! Okay, I'm gonna try not to draw his face because I'm gonna cover it up. But also, if I- yeah, I need to at least figure out which way he's looking. Hold on a second. I- I need to at least understand which direction this dude is- is, like, facing right now. So, like, if he's facing... Let's say something like this. And this is his head here. And then I guess his neck is here. Thank you for the lurk, Cypher! Good luck with work! I wish you the best! Oh my gosh. Chat, I have amazing news. I, 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 my, I'm safe. I'm safe. I am not losing my job. Ha! Oh, I got called into the office, like, on, what day was yesterday? Monday? And I was like, here we go! It's time to find out! But I'm okay. That was stressful. That was so stressful, though. Just a heads up. I was stressing. I was stressing. But I lived. Although I feel like a part of me might have died. I lived. Alright. Where do your shoulders go? Here, let me actually squish your head a little bit. Would you like your head to be a little bit squished? I sure would. Let's go indeed! You gotta love it. You, you gotta love it, y'all. 
All right. So I wonder if I should put like his neck is here. Got another shoulder. I think I just need to change where the neck is actually. I swear I keep getting jumped by harvester spiders. Like real spiders or in a game? Because one is more concerning than the other. If real spiders are jumping you, I'm concerned to great depths. You, you good over there? You alright? Actual IRL spiders. Oh my gosh. You're not okay then. You are- I- ooh. Alright. Well, time to move to freaking the North Pole. I don't think spiders can survive in that cold, right? Right? I don't think so. They keep appearing in your room? Alright, burn the house down! Say bye-bye, no more spiders. No more spiders in the house, everybody. Because there's no house. Did you know that you can't have spiders in a house if you have no house? Term, why do you look like Goldie? Why does term silhouette look like Goldie? Sorry, SB term. Why does SB term silhouette look like Goldie? It's because the gills are messed up. It's because... Aw, oh, man, they're like twins. But father and daughter. Dang. You actually don't think that's a good spot for the gills. I'm trying to figure out... Let's just leave the head there for now. Neck here. Let's do this. That should be fine. Just a little bit of a base. So I can work on the mask. Also, Goldie with white roots, new lore. Yeah. She's got white roots now. Um, she's, uh, she's been stressed. And you know what? It's not getting better. It's not, it's not getting better. It's just not, it's just not gonna get better. Cause she was, she got the freaking white roots in her hair. Um, before she even learned her mom was not her mom. Now she knows her mom's not her mom. Oh, she looks traumatized again. I was actually in Sky's chat the other day, and I asked in chat, uh, out of on like a scale of one to ten, how traumatized should I make Goldie look? And the responses were like in the range of eleven to thirteen out of ten. So, you know, I did my best, and I think, I think I didn't do half bad. You know? Oh, hi, Hatsune. Hi, Hatsune. How you doing? How you doing? I hope you've been having a lovely day. You're terrifying. I don't know how masks, like, work on people's faces. Why did we get it twice? Hatsune, calm down. We're not- we're not having a party. This ain't about you, girly pop. You are lovely, though. Don't get me wrong. But today is not your day. Very sorry. Alright. I feel like- Oh! Oh, we got the Goldie VTuber. Give me a second. Give me just a second. Here we go. Let me, um, let me braid my hair real quick. There we go. The hair is braided. Do you guys like the new toggle, by the way? Do you like the new toggle? Here, I want to turn on the smirk real quick. I did not mean to turn the grid on. Thank you. Thank you. Um, do you guys like the new braided hair? I, I really like it. Um, I'm actually gonna turn the smirk off just because it's making me laugh. <laughs> I need it off. I need it off. I'm gonna laugh. Okay, there we go. There we go. Can I? No. Why are the tusks tiny? This is the, this is the same size the tusks were in the previous model. The only thing I changed was how her, um, top fangs, like, appear. I change them slightly, but not a lot. Mostly just anatomy fixes. Or not really fixes, just decisions. Alright, how do I draw a spike? I don't know how I feel about this. Okay. Wait, it's got four! Bruh. Bruh, it's got four spikes. I don't like it. Okay, one, two, three. I feel like I'm drawing them too big. Hold on. One, two, three, four. Is that gonna work? Whoops. Whoops. 
Maybe it's because I don't have my glasses on and I don't give two. <laughs> yeah, you know what? I feel that. I too don't have my glasses on. But I too don't care to put them on. I've been wearing them all day. I'm done. It's fine. I don't usually wear my glasses a lot during streams. Um, I mean, I, obviously I do. You've seen me wear them during streams. But during my VTuber streams, I usually take them off. It's just easier that way. It helps tracking and whatnot. You know, maybe these wouldn't really be very visible. I've only worn them like four times this year. Dang. All right. Well, then you, you win. I've worn mine a lot more than that. I just usually... Dang. All right. You win. It wasn't a competition, but I guess also it maybe was a competition. I don't know. I don't know, man. This mask. This mask is creepy. I'm gonna maybe change it a little bit. Maybe. If I can think of a way to change it, I don't actually know. Um. Ah, where does this eyeball go? Ah! Ah! Whatever. Oh, I'm scared out of my mind right now. This is horrific! Why is it so scary, chat? It's just a mask. It's just a mask. Why is it so scary? Why is it giving me fear? Why, why am I overcome with the urge to cry? <laughs> it's creepy. It's creepy, chat. It's creepy. It's creeping me out. It's creeping me out and I don't like it. It's fine. Aha! We got one! We got an image! Bless your soul. <laughs> Term gave me an if- <laughs> Term gave me- Term gave me a, 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 a screenshot and my response was just bless your soul and then I took it and ran away. That- that's an incredible response, I think. I just went, bless your soul, and then I ran. Alright. Hi, SB Term. Everyone say, hi, SB Term. Now everyone say, are you okay, SB Term? And then after you say that, shake your head no. <laughs> I'm sorry, I shouldn't laugh at SB Term's misery. I'm not laughing at his misery. I'm just laughing because of how badly this mask is freaking me out. And I'm like, yep, you know, sometimes you gotta become the scary one. Sometimes when push comes to shove, you become the one that pushed. Sometimes you become the problem. Mm-hmm. Hey, chat, have you ever become the problem? I've certainly become the problem. I think I'm usually the problem. If there's one thing I excel at, it's at being the problem. Or something like that. I don't know. Uh, let's see. Okay. I want to know where SB Term canonically got this. <laughs> <laughs> I said bless your soul to Term as gratitude for giving me the screenshot and Term's response was don't it's the soul of a war criminal slash silly and I was like hello okay okay sorry there's so many people I'm chatting with um alrighty alrighty Back to drawing! Uh, where was I? Okay, it's got like some pattern up here that I'm just gonna make into like stripes or something. I'm not gonna directly copy Majora, Majora's Mask. I think that's what it's called, right? I don't know. I'm sorry. I'm not a Zelda expert. Please forgive me. Please forgive me all my crimes and, and uh, sins. I, I am very, very wrong all the time. I am, in fact, what most people call just wrong. <laughs> ah, I didn't mean to get rid of the background. Oh, gosh. Okay. Alright. Cool. 
We have a mask. Now, we just need to do... <laughs> I'm not trying to laugh at him. He just looks so dead inside. I just... He just looks so dead inside. I'm not laughing at him. I'm laughing with him. He's not laughing, though. So maybe, maybe I am laughing at him. My bad. My bad, bro. That's on me. I'm so sorry. It's... I... You know, I'm... So... <laughs> I feel bad. I feel bad. It's just, it's the eyebrows. It's the way you can just tell that he's, like, not amused in life. It, you can read it from his Minecraft skin. He's just, just, you can just, it's incredible. I think Term said this when he first showed that skin. He was like, it's crazy what a few extra pixels can do. And I think I giggled. Because I can't help but agree. Because it's like four pixels in total. And it changes his whole demeanor. It's fascinating. Anyways, let's draw those gills now. Um, one, two, three. I feel like I'm accidentally going for Goldie's gills right now, but I don't remember how I differentiated Term's gills. Two, three. I'll figure it out. I think Term's gills were more round but also messed up. I don't like this middle one. I don't know what I did with that weird little curve on it, um, but I didn't like it. Okay. I'm gonna remove the face. Can I remove the face now? Where's the face? Where's the face? Oh, there it is. Okay, it's gone. Um, no, it's, uh, we need to add a little bit of hair, I think. Something like that. Maybe. Okay. Now can we get rid of the face? <laughs> Anybody else a little scared? Only ever so slightly frightened. But overall, okay. But also, not okay. Am I describing this correctly? Do Am I making sense? It's fine if not. I think the fear is getting to me. How does this thing stay on your face? I don't know. I actually am not sure. How does this... How do you put this on, Derm? What? Where do the straps go? Where should I put them? Where should I put them? I can put them here? How is this sticking to your face, my man? How'd you put that there? Hmm. I'm gonna figure it out. Maybe I need to bring it down a little bit. Okay, bring it down. Maybe not. Hold on. Where's his face? Okay, okay. Let's bring it down to, like, here. All right. This is very normal. Okay. And then maybe bring these up. Uh. Ah! <laughs> I genuinely didn't know where I went for a second. I just, I, I, from the corner of my eye, I saw myself disappear, and I was like, it's over. <laughs> it's, it's over. We're gone, chat. We're just, we're flat gone. Gone forever. Okay. Alright. There we go. Um, okay, I need to remove these terms. They're, they're like, distracting me now. Um. Let's get the gills. We're gonna flip them. A little squish. A little squish. That's a good spot for them. Let me see. Yeah, that's a good spot for them. All right, and now we will erase. This is actually kind of smooth sailing on this. I thought that mask was gonna give me more trouble. I was kind of expecting the mask to give me a lot, a lot more trouble, but then I lived. But then I lived. <laughs> At what cost? At what cost did I survive? Alright, let me double check the picture. It has eyeballs. Okay. It's freaking me out. It's freaking me out! Oh my gosh! <laughs> Take it off your face! This is why- this is why Newt screamed when you appeared- <laughs> It looks like he's seen something. 
He's seen something extraordinary, but also horrific. Okay. Do I need to make the pupils larger, maybe? I want to make them, like, more, like, slit eyes. I think it would be a fun detail. Okay. I'm gonna maybe do this. I'm adding markings because I, I felt like it. I'm adding, I'm adding, I'm adding what I want to add. <laughs> it's creepy. Mm -mm -mm. I love being terrified! It's fine. He's doing so good. He's, um... <laughs> what is he wearing? Hold on. Is this like... Uh, it's not a tuxedo. Why does it look like a tuxedo? It's, it's not a tuxedo. It looks like a sleeveless tuxedo. Am I confused? Am I confused? I'm just gonna go for it. It's like, um... Well, we've definitely got a tie. I can I can discern that well enough. Um, so we've got some kind of tie, and so off of that logic, we have some kind of vest situation going on. Um, we've got a uh, 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 uh. sorry, that's the sound I make when I'm thinking really hard and it's not working. Uh, uh. I don't like using my brain cell, Chad. It hurts. Help me. Help me, please. Alright, here we go. No. Yes. No. Okay. Alright. <laughs> Wait, no, I've messed up so severely. Wait, I understand everything I've ever done wrong now. Oh, wait, I get it. It goes up here. Oh, I'm so smart when I use my brain. I'm so smart when I try hard enough. Okay. I'm just gonna do some fur. Um. Yeah. Let's put the shoulder here. Other shoulder is over here. Okay. Um. Where is the base drawing I made of your shoulders? Here it is. We're bringing it up so I can put them in the same folder. Pretty please and thank you. Because I'm going to make it a little bit larger and a little bit wider, I think. Something like that I think would be quite nice for you. It makes your head look less big. I have a, I have a problem where <laughs> I'm speaking a southern accent like a fool. I have a problem where I um, always make the characters' heads too large. And then I look back and I go, how could I let this happen? And then I remember, oh yeah, I let this happen. And yeah, that's basically the moral of the story. Oops, nope, stay, stay, stay uh, hidden. There you go. He's doing great. See guys, look at him. I've never seen a more put together man. What is this? <laughs> what is this thing that Term just sent me? What am I looking at? Probably fine. I, pr I feel like... Okay, I'm gonna not download it right now only because I'm streaming and I should probably pay attention to the fact that I'm live right now and not the fact that I'm talking to people on Discord while I'm streaming. I'm a good streamer. I pay complete attention to my chat. Sometimes. Occasionally. In certain periods of my life. Why is it so dull? Ah! I didn't expect to pull up. I didn't expect to pull up the close, the closely freaking frame of a terrified goalie. That was not what I was expecting in that moment. Jeez. <laughs> my bad. My bad. Sorry. Hi, Relics. Welcome on into the stream. Here, let me, um, let me grab this. There we go. Here we go. There we go. Got it. We're doing good. We're doing great. Who do we appreciate? Creepy. Bro, the mask is freaking me out. I mean, I like it, though. I do like it. I think it's fun. Like, okay, completely, I think it's really fun that this man is just going around with this mask. I'm like, oh, yeah, scare him. Scare him real good. It's funny. 
But also, then I drew it and I went, I'm part of the scared committee. I feel the fear. Why is he even wearing it? Um, because he doesn't want to show his face. Because he doesn't look very good right now. Because currently his face looks like this. <laughs> He's having a day, alright? He's having a little bit of a day. That is scarier than any face. Hey, hey. Oh, I'm, I'm drawing on the wrong layer. Hey, he is entitled to his opinions, all right? He thinks it's better than his face. So, so we're going to all agree with him, all right? We're going to make him feel loved and included, okay? We're going to be nice, all right, chat? Do we agree? We're going to be nice. And I'm entitled to disagree. Dang. Dang. You're really going at SB Term. What if he just likes the mask? What if it's comforting? You gotta, you gotta tell him that he can't wear it because, because, what if it comforts him? What if this is his safe item right now? Why is it that color? I said leave the little guy alone. I am leaving him alone. I'm the one who's telling you guys to be nice. I'll probably change the colors after I get them down there. Probably just, like, brighten and saturate them is what I'll probably do. But I just want to get all the colors done first. I'm not gonna lie. If I didn't know that this was the Majora's Mask, I thought these were, like, frills. I would so think that these right here are frills. I would 100% be like, why, why do you have confetti on your chin? <laughs> why do you- why do you have streamers? On your face! <laughs> but they're not streamers. They're little, they're like, they're like spikes or whatever. But if I didn't have something else to look at to let me know, I 100% would be like, Oh my gosh, he's like a pinata! He's like a pinata, does that mean we can hit him? <laughs> That's a horrible conclusion. Your honor, I may have hit that man, but only because he looked like a pinata. I feel like he was asking for it. Imagine that just appearing right behind you. No, that happened to multiple people. So many people were scared. So fun fact, I was able to see term, which I think was actually not supposed to happen. And I didn't think it was supposed to happen, but I had to just run with it. But I saw term like as like a dull little faint image of a man. And I was like, what's going on? Am I on drugs? Did Goldie take drugs without me knowing it? Because I just... Just watched my... My lost father walk by and I was like, um... Hmm? It's a really confusing experience, chat. Really confusing experience. Goldie was sniffing something. Apparently so! Apparently so! Goldie was sniffing and she was confused. Man. Man, oh man. Relics, have you seen the new thumbnail for the Spelldown VOD? It's, I think it's my new favorite. I think I say this every time I make a thumbnail, though, but it's my new favorite. I, and this time, I mean it. I say as if I didn't mean it the last time. New thumbnail? You want to see it? I have it pulled up right now, so I can just finish coloring this and... Here we go! New thumbnail! Wow! Look how happy she is! She's not happy. She's not happy, chat. So I got told to make it look as traumatized as possible. Oh, I think that every time I do a thumbnail, I just up the saturation more and more because it, mm, it's so tasty. I think I've discovered, chat, in my art that I just like the saturation. I think this is what I've discovered about myself this year. I think this is my self-discovery that I just... I love the saturation. Like, hold on. I'm gonna grab the last thumbnail I made. Alright. Last thumbnail was this. Which is good! This is a good thumbnail! Oh, sorry, that's term. But this! <laughs> Sometimes term just pops up out of nowhere. <laughs> but this! Okay, why are her gills green? It's called making deals with the devil. That you didn't even know was the devil. 
so I feel like she got that was just not great. Looking green around the gills, eh? Um, uh, yeah, a little bit. <laughs> and also, yeah, she does look like she's gonna be sick. Wouldn't you be sick too? Think with me, chat. Think with me. This is why I feel so bad for Goldie. She has been like having like sleepovers, um, spending the night with her mom in bed, snuggle time, like normal parent and child stuff. Normal parent and child stuff that's normal for a parent and a child. And then she finds out that that whole time, that was not her mom. That was her mom's body. But it wasn't her mom. It was some freaking demon! Wouldn't you be disgusted? Also, thank you for the hydration check. I just picked up an empty water bottle. I love the scrunch nose. Oh, I know. That's my favorite part. I worked so hard on the details on her face. Because she's covering her mouth. So everything else had to be extra expressive. And it, oh. The wrinkle, the nose, you can just see it. All right, drink the water. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, so, um... <sighs> I think I drew her gills more green only because I shaded them differently. Like, in this shading, I didn't up their saturation. And in this one, I did. But, like, the color is the same, see? It's the same color, it's just that STORM! <laughs> Every time! It's just that for this one, when I did the shading, I upped the saturation instead of leaving it dull like that, see? I figure it's kind of mostly color theory, because it's very similar. Basically, like I said, I upped the saturation. I may have done a little bit more green on there, but- TARM! Every- <laughs> I keep clicking the wrong file! <laughs> Every time. Every gosh darn time. <laughs> Why do I keep doing it? <laughs> Why can't I learn? Why can't I learn that that's term? That's the term file. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, every gosh darn time. Every gosh darn time. I'm gonna merge all these colors together and see if I can saturate it. Um, hue, let's see. Brightness, saturation, maybe? No! It did not want to saturate. Um. Wee! 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 It's the ever changing mask! It's like an emotional roller coaster! But. On your mask! Sorry. Sorry. Sorry, chat. I'll take it seriously. I promise. I promise. I'm a very serious person. I take everything I do very seriously. 100% for real, for real. Um, totes. Okay. Honestly, the colors are still... My eyes are staring... Wait, the eyes are staring into my soul. Yeah. Yeah, it does that a little bit. It does, it does tend to stare into your soul. Um, do not be alarmed. It just wants to be your friend. I think. I'm like, 12% sure that it just wants to be your friend. But I'm also like, mostly unsure. So like, moral of the story is I'm actually not sure. But like, I think you should give it a try. And see what happens while I stand behind a door. I mean, I'm sure you'll live, but in case you don't, I'll take your body, like, to be buried. So at least you won't be, like, I don't know, sitting somewhere awkwardly dead. <laughs> I feel like once you've died, you don't really care. <laughs> when I die, I don't want to sit there awkwardly dead. Like, it's just a preference, you know? Like, I prefer... Am I crazy? <laughs> Am I crazy or what? You know, I don't know, man. I'm trying to get the colors better. But I'm struggling. Okay, I need to brighten this, I think. Okay, and then I want to turn this more tan. Okay. And probably make that that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I forgot about the horns! I forgot about this part. Alright. 
Here we go. Over and over song. You're so right. Okay. Yellow, red, green, blue. Yellow, red, green. I saw an emote cr go across my screen, but I will not be distracted until I'm done. Blue. All right. All right. Ah, it was just relics dancing. It was just relics doing a little dance. As you do. Sometimes you just got to do a little. Yeah. Get it, relics. Dance! Dance, relics, dance! Sometimes that's all you can do, chat. Sometimes all you can do is a little dance. I'm actually gonna darken some of these. Let's um let's make the red maybe the same red. Oh, or let's erase the red completely, that too. Um the green can be the green of the eyes, and the blue can be this blue, I guess. Or erase it completely! That too! Yeah, that's always an option, apparently. Okay. Let's just, um, flip it. Wee Colors! Shapes and colors, chat! Shapes and colors! Don't you love it? Chat, on a scale of 1 to 10, how much do you love shapes and colors? Say 10, or I ban you. Alright, we're just gonna go with that and erase it. I'm fighting hiccups right now, so that's why I'm just, like, having moments of silence. because I'm in pain. It's because I'm dying, chat. It's because I'm in agony. Alright. No! It went out of the lines! There we go. Twelve. Good! You are not banned! On a scale of green to purple watermelon, I am just concerned about your well-being at this point. But thank you. Thank you for the gills. Um. Let's put some more tan. You wanna put tan on the stripes here? Maybe? I don't know what I'm doing. Chat! Chat! Your girl's confused. Is it obvious, chat? Chat, on a scale of 1 to 10, how obvious is my confusion? Confusion? Confusion. <laughs> well, I feel like that's gonna land me a solid 20. <laughs> it's the fact I couldn't even say the word. You're confused. I'm confused. I think we're all confused. I think we just need to face it and understand that we're all freaking confused. None of us know what's going on. None of us understand why we're here. Except that I'm just drawing and, and y'all are watching. For I don't freaking know why, but you're watching. Wow! Okay. Um, it's pretty great. <laughs> I told my coworkers that sometimes I just go around using a toad voice with my friends. And they said that's why people kill me in Minecraft. <laughs> it's literally what my coworker said. We were talking about Minecraft at work the other day. And one of my one of my coworkers was like, My favorite thing to do on Minecraft servers is build houses, but when you step inside them, they're just rigged to blow up. You don't have to go inside that house. You're the one who chose to go inside the house. Now you're dead. And I went, That's horrible. I like to go around using a toad voice. And they were like, that's why people kill you. <laughs> and I just had to sit there and be like, dang. They got me. They really got me, man. They they went right at me. They went right, they went for it. And I, I got got. It's unfortunate, chat. Truly, truly. <sighs> you also like going to other people's houses and exploding. Okay. Oh, why are you guys being so mean to me? I mean, yeah, you're right, but dang. If I had a nickel for every time I had jokes made about how often Goldie blows up, I'd have so many nickels! But also, she keeps blowing up! She keeps exploding! Inky, thank you for stopping by. Oh, I called you Inky again! I was doing so good last time! Well, you know what? You know what they say? Sometimes you get better, sometimes you rot. Anyways, I think that was the song that was just playing. Thank you for stopping by. Go get some rest if you're sleepy. It is really bad luck. Bro, I- when I first started playing Goldie as a character, I didn't know she was gonna get blown up. And then she did, and I was like, well, dang, that's pretty crazy. But cool, you know? Wow, gotta love the tasty lore, all the angst. 
And then, you know, we got rid of Junie, and I was like, okay, Goldie will no longer be in danger of blowing up. And then season two, episode freaking three, and I'm like, that was just not necessary. <laughs> I was like, why? Why can't she ever not get blown up? I'm Enki. No, you're Enoch. You're Enoch. You're... <laughs> You're Enki. You're Enki. You're freaking- you <laughs> I can't do it. I don't know why my brain can't do it, but it can't, so. You know, accept the unacceptable. Hashtag, I can't say your name. Hashtag, I'm so sorry. Hashtag, I don't need to be saying hashtag right now, but I can't stop. Sorry. Sorry about that. That's on me. You know, maybe I need to, um, saturate these gills a bit more. Maybe saturate them and make them a bit darker. That might fit better. Did I do it? Hold on. What if I turn down the saturation of this? What if we unsaturate term a little bit? Do you guys want to unsaturate SP term? You want to take away some of his saturation? Oh yeah! I like it. Golden needs explosion proof clothes or something. No, 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 no! You want to hear something funny that L told me the other day? You want to hear something funny that L told me? Um, SBL. SBL has a, like a thing, I think... I think it was given to him by SB Term at some point. I don't know. I could be wrong about that. Don't quote me. But it, like, is apparently some little magical thing that wards off explosions. <laughs> and I was like... <laughs> I feel like we gave that to the wrong child. <laughs> That's what I said. To be fair, though, it it is magical and Goldie is not big on the magic thing. But I do just think that's incredibly funny. I'm because <laughs> I just think it's a little silly. Because I'm over here like, well, you know, really valid concern, but also looks over at Goldie. You know, we got a track record in this direction. Why did I shade that? I'm not shading that. Why did I do that? Uh uh. Here, I'll make this dark blue actually. Um, that was hilarious to me. I was, like, cackling at that. <laughs> POV. There were good intentions, but I'm also just a little con con confused. Concerned? Concerned? Yeah, I'm concerned. Apparently, I'm concerned, chat. Alright. I think it's funny how kind of out of place this mask feels with the outfit. Like, do you guys agree with me? The mask feels just a little bit out of place with the outfit that's being worn. <laughs> it's like, it just, it's like it's, it belongs to a different outfit. It's like, uh, it's like one half of a cosplay. He just wants to look dapper. You're right. You're so right. He just wants to look dapper. I just feel like the colors aren't, what? What? I want to see if I can make the colors better, chat. I don't know what's bothering me. Also, really need to sneeze right now. Thank you! Thank you! I'm alive! Okay, um, I might actually do this. Slightly darker. I feel like that maybe works better. Well, what do you guys think? Do you like it better lighter or darker? Thank you for the head pad. So nice, so nice, so kind. Do you like it darker or lighter more? Okay, but why does your sneeze- Why does everyone say this? I think I heard a classmate whisper that today. <laughs> I sneezed in class and I'm telling you I heard somebody whisper that. And I was like, whisper quieter. I don't know, man. That's just how I sneeze. I don't know what to tell you. <clears throat> Everyone's like, how do you do that? I'm like, I, I don't know. I just sneeze. <laughs> You can't ask me how I sneeze like that. What am I, what am I gonna tell you? I think about it really hard, and, and then I sneeze like that. Whoa! Okay. I wanna go with maybe the darker mask. Let's put it in a folder. Oh, this is a good song to play. I really like this song now for Spellbound. Alright. Uh, SB Term, I'm gonna hide you away again. Oh, I forgot! This creepy doodle's in the corner. 
Um, I guess we'll put this over here. I love how small it is compared to SP Derm right now. Wait, when I position it this way, it looks like... <laughs> When I position it this way, it looks like he's just ignoring it. <laughs> I see nothing. <laughs> it just looks like he's walking away. It's perfectly positioned. It's perfectly positioned to just be like, la di da di da That's fine. Okay. Let's maybe, um, flip this and do it without the mask, perhaps, so we can see his tusks. I think that might be fun. So let's, um, remove the mask. Oh, why is your face over there? Good sir, that's not where your face belongs. Um, that's that's the creepiest thing I've ever seen. Oh my gosh. That's uncomfortable. That's actually more uncomfortable than the mask. Oh, I'm getting rid of that. I didn't like that at all, chat. How was that worse than the mask? <laughs> it was freaking Slenderman, but SP term. I did not like that. Jeez. <clears throat> Alright. Alright. You live and you learn. Don't... Don't, don't do what I did, unless you want to be absolutely terrified. Okay, um. Low opacity, so I can see what I'm doing. Um. Here we go. I Yes, I'm giving him the scar chin scruff. It's not because, like, I'm- It's not because, like, scar is evil. I just think the chin scruff is a fun, like, design for a character. But everyone now associates it with being evil, and I think it's unfortunate. I think it's a little unfortunate. I like it just as a character design, personally. So no, I'm not giving it to him to be like, ooh, he's a bad guy. I think it's just a fun design. And he's scruffy right now, so I think it fits. Alright. Um. I lost the- there it is. I was like, I lost the, like, low opacity version of his- of his face. Uh, there we go. Wait, no. The hair throws me off, because I'm not quite sure what I'm doing. I think a few other- I think a few other villains have the scar chin scruff. It's always villains! Can we give it to, like, a good character, please? Can a good guy have it? It's not a villain freaking chin thing. Don't gatekeep your chin scruff. That's, I hate that. <laughs> that was a weird way to put it. Um, good characters shave, I guess. Jeez. Jeez. Wow. Um, what kind of expression to give him? Tired, probably. Definitely tired. How to draw the eyes right. Alright. My man, sleep a little. Sleep a little, I beg! Nah, he's not gonna sleep, is he? Nah, he's not gonna sleep. Okay, that was maybe a little bit too much. I'm trying to make him look pretty ragged, you know? Because he's not, he's not, you know, he's had better days. Most definitely. Most, most definitely he's had better days. And he's not currently having those <laughs> better days, you know? Unfortunate, but true. He looks like he needs a good meal. I'm gonna merge this. Let's see, where's the rest of your face? Merge that. Where's your hair? Where's your hair? Where's your hair? I found it. Why are all the axolotls sad? Because, um, because... Their mom slash wife is like MIA in her own body. I don't know. I'm freaking <laughs> missing an action in her own body. That's horrible. I don't know. I don't know, man. It's just unfortunate. MIA in her own body. Am I wrong? I am I wrong? <laughs> she's not missing an action. She's right there, but like also she's not right there. You know. I, I, 
No, but like, look, man, I don't know. I don't know. Is it? <laughs> it sounds so bad. I, yeah, demon possession usually does. I feel like, I feel like on an average demon. I don't think I don't know if it, I don't know if it's possession. Demon, demon, let me borrow your body. Thank you. Move over. Scooch over. Cattle is usually not seen as very great. I feel like I'm just gonna go out on a limb. I'm gonna go out on a really, really hefty limb, uh, tree trunk, and be like, I feel like that's not usually <laughs> viewed with a thumbs up and a smile. <laughs> what did you do today? Well, you know, <laughs> the demon stuff, you know, every now and then you gotta, you gotta, you know, grabby, grabby hands. What a nice body you got there. Oh, wait, that didn't turn out good either. That's not a great sentence either. What a nice vessel this could be i don't know there's no good way to word this i'm stuck i'm glad ads just popped up hey hey you want to get away from me that badly that's just that's just mean that's just mean what if that hurt my feelings you're probably right though run away run 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 away anyone who's currently here right now it might be better if you run you, you might be better off if you simply flee the scene of the crime. Have you ever considered running away from here? Okay. I'm trying to get the gosh darn nose. Why do the noses always get me? Why? Why? Come on. Um... Welcome back, Relics! I hope the ads treated you well. I'm just losing my mind trying to draw the freaking little axolotl nose. One day, one day I won't lose my mind trying to do this. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Oh, rotate! Flip! And now he can see in- Now- <laughs> My, what big eyes you have! Starf! Starf, is that you? Hi, Starf! Hello, Raiders! Welcome to the stream! Starf, you were doing Minecraft, right? I'm like 53% sure it was Minecraft. I forgot my raid message. Hi, hello! You're all fine. You're all good. Uh, in my heart, you had a raid message. Don't even worry about it. Don't even worry about it. It was Minecraft, though, right? It Was it the Western... The Wild West is- wow, the Western SMP. That's really what I wanted to say. <laughs> Were you on the Western SMP? Over there in the Western area of the region? Oh shoot, that was his eyeball. Hi, Star. Thank you so much for the raid. Here, let me get you a shout out real quick. Shout- oh, never mind. Let me misspell shout out. Shout out the- oh no, I have to see- I have to do your name right. I never do this. King of- <laughs> I'm so scared right now. I'm so scared. Okay. Yes, it's you! Chat, Raiders, the reason why I was so scared of doing that is because Starf knows firsthand how many times I do not type in the right name for Starf. Starf saw what my, my Twitch search history looked like, and it was literally... What was it, Starf? What was it? It was like... <laughs> it was like... King of the Starfish. <laughs> it was like King of the Starfish. And then it was also, I think, Starfish King. And like Star firsthand saw. <laughs> I was sharing my screen and I clicked on my search bar and those like previous suggested searches popped up and I was like, Starf, look away. Starf, look away, please. It was, um... It was a little embarrassing, but honestly, it's the truth. I can never type in... Here's the issue. When I search King of the Starfish, it doesn't give me Starf. When I search Starfish King, it gives me Starf, I think. Maybe I have it backwards. No, I think it's that way. So then I keep instead searching Starfish King because I'm getting positive results. And that's not what it is. Also, Raiders, hello, hi. My name is Olive underscore Jests. I'm a little fool and we're drawing spellbound stuff today. Uh, I'm currently just drawing Term because that man, SP Term, is not having a good time. He's, uh, he, oofta. Oofta, oofta. He's tired. 
Someone help. Why does he have Simba's hair? I don't care. I'm, he's keeping it. He's like Simba, but I don't know if he gets a happy ending. He's like Simba, but his dad didn't die. Because he didn't have one. <laughs> Did you guys know that you can't, like, you can't... <laughs> I was gonna say, you can't lose your dad if you never had one to lose. <clears throat> Anyways. Anyways, chat. It's, it's, it's such a good day today, isn't it? Lovely day. Lovely, lovely day. Um, I love being totally normal and not digging myself into holes with the things I say. Absolutely love it. 10 out of 10. L wonderful. Ba da da ba da ba 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 freaking yep. What am I missing here? Something feels- oh, oh, where are the photos? Ah, there. Tusked up term. Got them tusks. Alright, let's uh, get those doogled on there. Oh my gosh, Starf, can I just say, I felt so bad. I felt so bad for SB Fish having to get in the freaking bath with the demon. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Starf. This is probably terrifying for poor SB Fish. They were sweating. Well, luckily they were in a bathtub, so no one could really tell. But yeah, I am... I am very sorry. That's unfortunate. That's truly unfortunate. <laughs> Goldie really went, get out in here! And, and Fish was like, I'd rather die, but okay! Oh, man. Oh, man. I feel like SB Fish definitely had more interactions with SB Sky than they wanted to that day. Went to cry to Echoes about it immediately after. Oh, no, really? Oh, I feel so bad. Goldie didn't know. Goldie knows now, though, but Goldie didn't know, you know? Goldie was 100% completely unawares, and I feel so bad for Goldie. I actually, man, Starf, I feel so bad for Goldie. <laughs> poor, poor Goldie. Oh. Starf, have you seen the thumbnail I finished earlier for, um this week's this week's episode though like it it's good i i put all my work into making her look so traumatized i did oof that mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. poor poor goldie you know sometimes in life your mom's secretly a demon you know <laughs> sometimes you're being lied to it happens. It really does. You'd be surprised. You'd be surprised how often it occurs. It's a little concerning how, how often it seems to occur at this point. Well, not really the mom reason, but just the, hey, look at that dude. He's totally who he is. No, he's not. Gosh, freaking darn it. <laughs> well, never mind, guys. But, yeah, Goldie now has knowledge and she's very disturbed. I'm disturbed for her, you know? Like, uh, the thing is, Goldie, Goldie, I think, spent the most time, like, Goldie would, like, spend, like, would be in bed with SB Sky. SBL still slept in his own bed. Goldie didn't. Goldie, like, has probably the most time under her belt. Now I feel so bad for her. Hi, Elle, welcome to the stream. How you doing? How you doing? I hope you are doing very, very well. Actually, I think you guys are brain rotting in there, aren't you? There's like a bunch of people in the live, laugh, trauma. How dare. Without me? It's fine. I'm drawing SB term. <laughs> I'm living my best life too. Don't even worry about it. <clears throat> I say and then I like cough like I'm gonna die. I'm living my best life. Proceeds to perish. No, no, no. It's all good. It's all good. All right. Eyebrows. He has eyebrows! Yippee! Okay, does his hair- is his hair- Okay, I'm just gonna- I'm gonna go with that. It's fine. Oh! Keep accidentally clicking on traumatized Goldie. It's a little bit funny. It's a little bit funny! In the slightest ever possible way, it's a little bit funny. Here are your tusks, good sir. 
Here are your tusks. Actually, hold on. I want to see if I can add some detail. Hold on. I feel like since they came in so suddenly and fast, I'm just gonna... Maybe. I'll figure it out. Um, I want to brain rot so bad. I have an appointment in like 10 minutes. Mean to me! Ah, we all struggling today, aren't we, Starf? It's so sad. I would love to brain rot too. I want to brain rot so badly. I always want to brain rot though. Like, that's nothing new. That's nothing new at all. Um, honestly though, L, after I end stream, I might, um, send a few more messages over to you about next episode. Um, if, you know, if you want. I don't know why I said it like that. <laughs> why did I sound like the slug monster from freaking Monsters, Inc.? What was that? <laughs> why? Why did I do it that way? It's fine. We all make strange decisions in life, you know? That one was mine. That was my strange decision. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. It's just a little scratched up. He's just a little scratched up. That's okay. That's alright. It happens. And now we gotta get his eyes. What is his eye color? Blue. <laughs> said that so. <laughs> blue. He's got the blue eyes. All right, here you go, good sir. A little bit of eye color never hurt nobody. Grab, I grab the color. I think this uh poster art is like a year old now, which is absolutely insane. Is it a year old now? It might be over a year old. How old is this poster art? I don't know, it's still my wallpaper though. It's so good, the full drawing of this. You guys might not know what it looks like, but you should because it's incredible. It's good. Chef's kiss. L, don't say a word about that. I know I can't trust L with that sentence. Every time I say chef's kiss, L's like, <gasps> Do they? And I'm like, ah, they're about to never kiss again because I'm gonna slaughter them all. If you keep this up, there will be no more chefs left in the world. He's so sad. He's so sad and scrunkly. Oh, the poor SB term. All right, and now we gotta add a few more touches, everybody. All right, we gotta add a few more touches. He's, um, let's see. This is not really the color I wanna use, but I'm just gonna use it to distinguish it better. Well, hold on, let me pull up the Minecraft skin again real quick to look at it. Okay, yeah, I can do this. Um, probably start around here. Okay, no, I don't know about that. I'm struggling a little bit. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. It's gonna be okay. Um, st stares aggressively, contemplates even more aggressively. Mm. Come on. Maybe I'll just... Kind of not very, not just kind of messily fill it in and then fix it. I might do it that way. Plink, plink. What? You, plink, plink. Is this just a plink, plink to let me know you're alive or a plink, plink because you have something to say? I gotta. I need explanation. Please explain your plinking. Sometimes it confuses me. All right. Color that in gonna lower opacity it. Here, let me just actually just fill it in and then I'll just erase what I don't want of it. I think that's how I'll do it. That might help. Okay. Erase! Be gone! Like that? Yeah? Yeah? Does that work? Oh shoot! I went back a little too far? Not my intention? Not my intention at all? Oh. Guys, I feel really bad for him. Oh, he does not look good. Oh, he does not look good in the slightest. Oh, no. Oh, no. I've done too good of a job at making him look so... Oh, no. Now I feel bad. Now I feel bad, chat. 
Poor guy. Poor guy. I feel bad. He doesn't look happy. It's because he's not happy, but, you know, still. <laughs> he doesn't look happy. I wonder why. Maybe because he's not happy. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say that maybe he's not having a great time. Oh, wait. I just got a good idea. What if I made the, the, this is not orange, made the green on this brighter. I almost called this color orange. This is, this is not orange. I almost really messed up my colors. That was almost quite unfortunate. Yeah, I think that's nice. Okay. <laughs> wow, it's SB term. Having a really great time, right? 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 Not really. Okay, I'm gonna put that in the same folder. Um, I'm gonna open, actually... What was that drawing I made a little while back? I don't think I actually have the finished version on my... F this is not my phone. On my PC. This is not my phone! <laughs> Looks dead at PC. This is a phone! No, it ain't! No, it ain't! This is, like, the furthest thing from a phone I've ever seen. Okay. There's an art... Piece. Where is it? I at least have a whip of it. Maybe I don't have it on here at all. No, I know where it is. This. Okay, I wanted to pull up this drawing. Because I want to know, do I want to do something with this or just make something similar? Because I don't know if this should... I feel like... I feel like I need to change my starting soon screen for Spellbound now that this isn't really... You know... <laughs> You know, she, yeah, she's not having the sleepover with her mom anymore. <laughs> what are PCs but big phones? You're so right, actually. What are PCs but simply large phones? You were not supposed to do that. Thank you. You were supposed to go freaking across the whole canvas, not just a one little small part. All right, let's play around with this. Let's play around with this. Let's put some fear in her face. Why the heck not? Why the heck not, chat? She's traumatized. Let's show it. If you traumatize your characters, make sure you show it. If you traumatize your characters, then you know it. Clap your hands. That's too many syllables, unfortunately. Um. Psst. Oh, man. Girly Pop is, uh, not sleeping well, probably. <laughs> I don't- I never know where to put your eyebrows! Where do your eyebrows go? Why do eyebrows throw me off? And why did I say it like that? Eyebrows! Said it like I was being murdered. Um. There we go. No, I don't like that expression. Um. No. Um. I could settle on that. Wait, nope, wrong. We'll put that there and that there. Something like that. I'm trying to get trauma, you know? I'm trying to express the trauma in her face without doing too much. I don't know if I'm succeeding. We'll probably just keep trying later. Um. Milo, what are you barking at? Chat, what do you think he saw? Was it the demon? You know what I will not recover from? Being at the end of my stream last episode and making a joke about freaking SB Sky and then my door opening by itself and me being like, SB Sky, is that you? I'm not just kidding. <laughs> I was like, I didn't mean it. Please, don't not the brooch. I'm scared. It was an experience. I just, my door just opens on its own and I was like, wait. I sense I've made a mistake. I sense regret in my soul. Wait, can I put this down to just one column? One row? No, one row, please. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, oh, I'm not trying to spin it. I don't want to spin it. Trust me. It's not what my goal is. I always spin things when I don't mean to. It's like, it's just something I do a lot on accident. Hmm. I might just go bald and try again. Let's just... Let's just go bald. 
Chat, don't you just love going bald sometimes? Sometimes. <laughs> chat, have you ever gone bald before? <laughs> have you ever considered it, chat? It's really easy. Just, just, you know, go bald. Just, just go bald. You should do it. You should give it a try. It'll be an interesting experience. I'm curious about it. I'm not going bald. I'm a hypocrite. Also, my hair, like, barely grows. If I went bald, I'd be bald for so long, you guys. It's not even funny. It's not even funny how long I would probably be bald if I went bald. My hair does not like to grow. It just, it loves not being good at its one job, which is to exist. Um, so I'd be very, very, very un- you know, it would be unfortunate if I went bald. We'll just put it that way. It would be a, an occurrence, to say the least. How do I make this look like she's looking more this way? See, I can't do these kinds of, like, poses. It, 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 it's a struggle. Where does your- Dear diary, where do eyeballs go on the head? And will I ever understand them? My diary spoke back to me. It said no. That's unfortunate. That's unfortunate, you know? That's- that's too bad. Starf, where did SB Fish sleep last stream? Wait a second, where were you? <laughs> I don't remember crap! Where did you sleep? Where did you go? You're not part of the sleepover, right? Who's in the sleepover? It was a large sleepover happening. It just hit me. I was just sitting here and I went, where the freaking, where the heck did SB Fish go? <laughs> Wait. On today's episode of Can You Spot SB Fish? Yes, they were. You were at the sleepover? Ah, oh, shoot. Goldie was like so traumatized and out of it. She didn't even know. She, she put herself in the basement. And, and hold herself up in a corner of the basement. Dang. Well then, well then, Fish, you get to be, um... If you're in the, if you're in the house with the sleepover party, you get to be... You get to be first-hand experiencing Goldie's... <laughs> holding herself up in the basement. She's having a wonderful time. Wonderful, wonderful time, surely, yeah. <laughs> I'm laughing because it's a lie. I'm laughing because I'm lying. As you do. As you do. Um. I might just change this pose a lot, honestly. I would like to keep it pretty similar, but it might just need to get changed. We'll see, we'll see. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Well, it'll be great to hang out some more, maybe. Y maybe. I don't freaking know. I have no idea. We'll see. We'll see come next Spellbound episode. We've got, like, what? Seven, six days now? When is Sunday? What day is it? Tuesday? Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Is that five days? Oh, Lord. Or is it six days? I can't count. Somebody do it for me. Somebody count for me, because I freaking can't, apparently. Apparently this is my, my newfound weakness, although it's actually not new in the slightest. I always knew I couldn't count. I just always tried anyways. Um, how did I draw this last time? Five days, five days. Wow, guys, already just five days until the next Spellbound. Man, Fish, I hope that my Wi-Fi company fixes whatever they did in the next five days. I'm getting really annoyed because Fish, just so everybody knows, Fish is who helped me last time so that Spellbound actually ran like a good stream. I thank you, Fish. But guess what I had to do again, Fish? Downgrade my bitrate today. Again, because I got too busy to call the Wi-Fi company yesterday and then I just, they, you know, couldn't call them. It was too late. And so, freaking, I set up stream today, and I realized it's not working very well again, so I had to downgrade it again, and I'm like, I can't keep crunchifying my stream, alright? 
they're like most definitely doing something over there. So I'm just I'm gonna try and call them today, and if not, call them earlier in the day tomorrow. Even though I'm freaking busy all day tomorrow. Actually, shoot, I'll figure it out. I need to call them at some point, and they need to answer me, because it's like it's getting worse day by day, and it needs to be fixed by at least Sunday. On the one hand. It's not that my internet's bad, like, to the point where I wouldn't be able to be on Spellbound. The worst case scenario is I would just have to record Spellbound, but I think they'll probably fix it before it gets too bad. Hopefully. You know. So far, I can get streams to run. I just have to keep changing my stream settings, and I don't like it because it's, it's like a bunch of trial and error. So I'm going to hopefully give them a call, and hopefully they'll, they'll, they'll do their job! They'll do their gosh darn job and let me stream. Hi, Captain Craft. Welcome on in. Hope you're having a good day. But I do thank you, Fish, for being, I don't know, in, in the area when I was testing it before Spellbound Sunday. I'm like, you were mostly just there watching me, but, you know, I thank you anyways. <laughs> I appreciate your presence. We'll put it that way. For anyone who doesn't know... Starf is great. We love Starf. And um, we will now sing the sacred song. <clears throat> Starfish King, you are the king. Ba -na 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 -na. Starfish King. It's a good song. It's a good, it's a good. 10 out of 10. It should be known by all of society. Oh. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh, it's your song, Starf. Starf, it's your song. We're singing your song, Starf. I honestly might change this a little bit more. I'm thinking, um... I don't know why I'm struggling really hard with it. Come on. I have, like, an idea in my head for how I want to change this, but it's, like, not wanting to work with me, so hold on. <sighs> hmm... Hey, so anyways, did you run to my appointment? Uh, yeah, I actually do have good art. We'll be back later. Are you sure? Are you sure? Are you sure you're not just running away from me? It feels to me like maybe you're just running away. But you can't run away from our appreciation, Starf. It's not possible. Alright, I'm gonna like give up on this and just go bald. Hold on. Go bald. Let's do, um... Can I get an image of a bedroom, actually? Hold on. Bedroom art ref. What dramatic lore are you adding to your character to make them more interesting? Um, Spellbound... Her mom's not her mom. Wow, what a concept. <laughs> Why did it come right after her mom is not her mom? Why did it come directly after that? Why? Her mom's not her mom. Wow, what a concept. Wow. Wow, you, you're so right. What a concept indeed. Where is the images? Here we go. Hydration check. I'll do that in just a second. I need to find a reference for a bedroom so I can do a drawing. But all these references are like above, above bed. Like it's looking above the bed. That's just a cat! That's just a cat! How is that a reference of a bedroom? That's a cat! That's a straight up cat! What? It's not even- it's not even a cat sitting on a bed, it was just a cat! What? Um... I need like a- okay, hold on. How about bed side view art ref? Okay, this is not amazing, but it is slightly better, so I might use it. Um, I guess this is what we'll have to go with. Let's see. Let's maybe grab... Hmm. <gasps> Wait, we can make it a sleeping bag, actually. We could say it's... A oh! Hold on. Sleeping bag on floor art ref. No, I don't want a person in the sleeping bag. Empty sleeping bag on floor. Um, this is just, it's hating me. It's giving me, like, why do I keep getting above views? 
I want it to be, like, perfectly lined up with the floor. I don't want to be looking down at it. Um, struggling, chat. The struggle is so real when you're an artist. Whale. Whale, chat. Ah, uh, whale! <laughs> what? This is just, like, a fancy circle bed. That's not a sleeping bag in the slightest. Hmm. Possibly making an axe little beanbag. Uh, no. Only reason I'm saying no to that is that's not traumatic enough. Um, let's see. Let's do... I need a art reference for, like, laying down. I'm not really good at drawing characters laying down, and that's what we're about to have to try! Gotta love it, gotta love it. Um, why is it another cat? Well, every- I- human! I was like, person laying down art reference, and it gave me a cat laying down. And I'm like, what's going on? I'm confused, chat. I don't understand why the internet insists on giving me cats right now. Okay, I'm- that's a penguin. I guess I've scrolled far enough to where it's just decided it's run out of human beings to give me, and I get to have random animals. Isn't that great? Isn't that great, guys? That's my favorite. I love it so much. You know what? I can just work off of one of these, maybe. Let me copy this, and I'll work off of this. Um... We'll work off of this, I think. It wasn't really my intended. Like, I didn't intend an above view. But I think this is what we're gonna have to work off of. Like, this is all we've really got. So we're just gonna go with it. Let's maybe put it in the corner here. So I guess we're I going got the ads ground. And remembered I got Prime. So I destroyed the ads for at least a month. Hey, sometimes... Sometimes you just gotta go out there and destroy ads. You're so right, though. You're so right. Also, thank you for the sub with Prime. Sub for 20 months. Thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. You really said, be gone, ads. Nobody wants you here. And then... Then you cast them away. You really did just say, no thank you. <laughs> Hashtag destroy ads. Yeah, you know. Understandable, really. So, we're just gonna work off of this. Like I said, not really my intended drawing idea, but I think I'll I'll be able to get by on it. It's not the worst. Oh, but her eyes are not gonna be closed. They're gonna be open. Okay. 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 Yeah, I want them to be opened up wide, actually. I want it to look like she's actively traumatized. Okay. Yeah. We love active trauma. Twitch reminded me about ads and I hated the traumatic memories. What? What did they do to you? What did the ads do? That was so traumatizing. Wh what happened? It really went the trauma that I forgot I even experienced, but then I remembered that I experienced it and I said, no. No, I will not let it happen again. And I'm like, oh, are you okay? You good over there? Round head. Cringe ads. Mmm. Mmm, you're right. Very traumatizing. Okay. I don't like how wonky that looks. Um, uh, maybe... Squish it a bit. Because that might help. That might help. Shoulders here. I need to up this a little bit more. I need to understand. Where's her other shoulder? Okay, I think I see it. I couldn't see it on low opacity. It's, it's like over here. I was just a little unsure for a second there. I, I couldn't. I couldn't understand what I was looking at. Um... So then, something like this. Uh, I don't know how art references do it. They're so good at being references. And then I'm, and then I try and do them and I go, wait a second. 
I got lost like one third of the way into the journey. Specifically those ones that make you think the game is really hard. Oh, no, yeah, I don't like those ads. I don't think anybody does, though, truly. I think those are, like, universally despised. Probably. I'd assume. Why do they do that? Like, oh, oh, if we make them angry enough about this, then maybe they'll just download the game themselves and play it to prove how easy it is. No, I'm just gonna judge you. I don't want to play the game, but I I will judge you for for this monstrosity. Thanks, I guess. Okay. Well, you, you know what they say. Um, sometimes you just gotta judge people, and that's that's that really. <laughs> it's actually horrible. Don't judge people, Jet. Um. Let's see. Let's see. I'm gonna low opacity that even more. This is the, the one difficulty I have when it comes to art references is I never really follow them to a T. So then I like have to figure out how they work a little bit without them. But then also I'm, I, I, I'm just trying to understand this pose very, very much so. And, and it's difficult. Honestly? Hold on. Hmm. Can I... Well, no, I do like this pose. So the hand is like... Here. I think it's in a fist of some kind. Arm is here. Elbow is here. Mostly it's just that it's a lankier character than I tend to draw. So that's why it always feels a bit off. I might just draw this and then draw over it again to get it about right. So we'll, we'll just see how it goes. We'll just see how it goes, everybody. Plus, I like half this character will be covered up, I think, with a blanket or something. So that does, like, change the game a little bit. So. Well, that's a little bit wrong. That's a little bit better. We'll go with it. Not quite right, but, you know, I'm just using it as a little bit of a bare follow-along. Okay. So I don't like it. It just doesn't fit, so I'm just gonna merge that. And we're gonna go off from there. Okay, let's see. Shoulder here. You hear spine. Did you do drawing class or are you self taught? Completely self taught. They tried to put me in art classes. I got really mad and left. <laughs> they tried My parents tried putting me in art classes. And I never liked the professors or the teachers. And I would, like, two weeks into the class be like, I'm not going back. And my parents would be like, why aren't you going back? Don't you want to draw? And I was like, I'll draw how I want to draw. I don't want to draw birds. Picture perfect. That's actually a very vivid memory I have of one of my, like, art assignments in the class was to just copy a bird from a photo of a bird onto, like, a grid. So it was, like, picture perfect, like, by every panel of the grid compared to the photo. And I said, no. I said, I know no wanna. And then I quit. Um, I would probably, um, benefit from some anatomy classes. But I have not taken any. Um, I do not understand anatomy. It's quite unfortunate. It's, I, I understand enough to make it usually look possible but usually i don't i'm a confuzzled like legs the legs are hard for me but also this character isn't really human so that's another reason why it's like oh boy how do i draw her legs um her knee is like right here her knee is right there free creativity hello l the character's anatomy bends to my will. I don't know if that's, like, the best way 
I don't know, man. You still gotta have a little bit of anatomy in there. Um, okay. Leg. See, this is difficult, because like I said, she's not a normal human. She's not a human. So I'm trying to figure out if her legs would kind of bend like this or bend a little bit differently. Let me grab red. Sometimes I just need to draw in red. Okay. So if that's... No, hold on. We're trying, I'm really trying to figure this out right now. It's not really working. Hold on. Where do I want to put her legs or, or feet or whatever? Not like that. They are noodles in my drawing. Ah, I see, I see. Uh, what advice would you give someone who really wants to get into art? Man, just start drawing stuff. Draw a little bit every day. Like, you're bound to get better. I started drawing back when YouTube was, like, pretty young and the only art tutorials you could find, also specifically I was looking at, like, Warrior Cat art tutorials, were very bad quality as well. Like, it was, like, back when art tutorials on YouTube for Warrior Cats was also, like, whoa, why do they look like that? But... Like, everyone just, you know, draw- Forget not to say Miko! Draw every day. Just a lot of practice. Also, everyone's gonna be like, tracing is the worst thing you can ever do in your entire life. I learned art by, by, like, using references, tracing references, blah, blah, blah. Tracing is bad if you're gonna trace something and say you drew that thing. But if you're using references- and you're just trying to understand what you're doing, and you're not over here being like, yeah, I made this completely. That's a really good form of learning. What the heck was that? That was Hatsune Miku. She, she happens sometimes. Don't worry about her. She pops up every now and then. Also, Cryptid, hello! Welcome on in. Welcome to the, um, welcome to my struggle bus. Welcome to my current struggle bus, um, called Anatomy, and my lack of knowledge on it. Really, really do have a lack of knowledge on it. I actually am going to have to take an art class later this year because I had to go into, I had to like, I have to do art electives to be able to graduate from my college major. So I had to take freaking, what did I do? What did I enroll in? Art 1, I think was the class. So whatever the heck that has me do, I got to do that now. Thrilling, I know. Yeah, I think I'm going to try and reference this one better. That was the funniest thing I've ever seen. Me screaming at Hatsune Miku. I'm glad that me screaming at Hatsune Miku could give you joy. Really, really. Anatomy practice is basically tracing as long as you're not passing it off as your own slash making money off of trace art. Nobody should give. Exactly. Thank you, Cryptid. That's what I was saying. See, I like to go find some good references. But at the same time, I do not stick that. <laughs> they are very different. Mostly because I don't... She's not human! <laughs> what do I do with these legs? Anyways. And then, I, do you, you guys don't want to know how many times I, like, use my own photos for freaking art? I'll just literally, I will literally take a photo of myself in the specific pose that I can't find on the internet and use it. Also, Grizz Just Bear, thank you so much for the gifted sub. Thank you, thank you. Congratulations. Who got it? Who got it? Oh, freaking Hatsune! Chill out! I'm trying to read. Oh, Mage got it! Congratulations, Mage, on the gifted sub. Thank you again, Grizz Just Bear, for the gifted sub. I really appreciate it. I feel like you're just here. For... What's that? What's that audio? What's that audio that's like, I feel like you're just here for the zip line. That's my stream, but it's Hatsune Miku. I feel like you're just here for Hatsune Miku. What? No. And then Hatsune Miku pops up. I feel like you're just here for Hatsune Miku. And I don't think I'm wrong. My goodness, am I struggling. Also, I don't think I need to keep struggling on this because she's probably gonna not have her legs shown that much. Because she'll probably have a blanket on? I don't know. I'm First of all, I'm deleting that one. That one is just not good. Um. Here, let's maybe... Oops. I've grabbed the wrong one. This one. 
Stretch. Squish. Something like that. Oh, we got them barking Milo again. I wonder what he's barking at. What could it be? What could it possibly be? Could be a leaf. Could be a car. Could be a person. Could be the sun in the sky. Could be a bird. He actually does not like birds. Fun fact. Um, he doesn't like when birds fly over the house because it's like, quote unquote, his domain. So he doesn't like when birds fly over. He's, uh, he's just a big baby, basically. Man, I'm stuck. I'm so stuck right now. Hmm. So neck is here. Okay. Shoulder. Yeah, maybe a little bit more oval for that. Shoulder. Arm. What was that? Oh, look that. Chad Alotl has a LaCroix. Congratulations, little guy. Drink up. You know what? Actually, I'll join you, buddy. I'll join you. Cheers, Chad Alotl. LaCroix. Mmm. Gotta love it. Gotta love it indeed. Okay, let's actually ignore the arms right now. So, chest, back, I don't know, torso, torso, whatever the heck that's called, um, her spine, I don't know, somewhere like, like I said, anatomy, I don't understand it. Um, probably around here, maybe? So then... Put her leg... I mean, I would like for the leg to be kind of higher up towards her chest, but I just don't know how to draw that right now. That's the struggle at the moment. Let's see. No, no, they need spines. They need to have spines. It's important. Um, I think maybe... Nah. I think... Let me actually merge this. And grab this. And maybe just not as... I don't want to- cylinder is not the word. Not as curved. I really went not as cylinder. And then I knew in my head that saying not as cylinder was not the sentence I wanted to go for. But I, for the life of me, couldn't figure out anything other than cylinder for, for a good hot second there. I'm actually going to squish this and see if this helps me a little bit. Okay. Let's actually... Mesh transform and see if we can move you over a bit, maybe. A little bit. A little bit like that. Pringle can. This is not a Pringle can, though. This is this is a character. Not a Pringle can. I beg. Okay. Something like that, maybe. Maybe. I just realized that I can actually just use her tail to cover up her legs. And usually I try not to do that trick because I did that trick a lot when I was growing up drawing cats. But sometimes I think it's still a good trick to use. Um, so I might honestly use that just because I really don't know how I'm going to go about drawing her legs. So I think we're going to use that for now. Um, what is this? What is this? L back with a... Streak of 40? Nice! Congratulations on your stream streak of 40. Pop off. Pop off. You've done good. You've done good. I don't know why I said it like that. You've done good. Good job today. So what traumatic thing did this character go through? What traumatic thing has she not gone through? Um, she got... She's gotten blown up. A lot. She's already gotten blown up so much. Um, her mom is not her mom it's a demon that's that's not great she made a deal with this demon because she thought it was a pinky promise to her mom so that's great gotta love it 
Uh, her trauma is ongoing because she's a character I play in a Minecraft server. So it's not even like her trauma is not over. It's an ongoing event. Because every every week there's, there's, there's more story going on thus far. Here, I might... What can I do? What can I do with your arm? Um, hold up. If your elbow is here... Alright. Okay. Maybe hand is here. And your elbow is here. That's not amazing. Maybe squish it a bit. Ah, the art of squishing things all the time. Sometimes you just gotta squish your art a little bit. Okay. Is it Goldie? I think that's the name. I haven't been here in a while. It is indeed Goldie. This is the Goldie. The Goldie gal, the Goldie girl. We love her very, very, very much. She's very, very, very sad. It happened. Oh, sorry, that's term. That's SP term. <laughs> I forgot how sad he looked. My goodness. Okay. No one's having a great time. Currently, all the characters are having a rough time. You know what? I take that back. I'm sure the demon is having a wonderful time. I'm sure. Olive, I knew you were a bit loony toony, but traumas? Huh? Zelda reference? This is a legit mask in the server. Where is it? Oh, it's being hidden. Like, literally. <laughs> literally, it's a, it's a mask you can wear on the server. It's incredible. It scared the crap out of everybody last episode, but it's still incredible. You know, maybe this is the better arm if I change it a little bit. Let's see. Let's see. Like this, actually? If I do it like that. I don't think my Wi-Fi is doing too great right now. Ah, uh, you know what? Mine either, bud. You and me both. You and me both. I'm glad we can relate on that. All right. Wow. I'm trying to figure what out. What a concept. What a concept indeed. Thank you for the follow. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome on in. Welcome to uh, trauma. Welcome to me trying to draw a traumatized character, but being traumatized by my attempt at being at drawing a traumatized character. What is anatomy? Toon, do you understand anatomy? Because I don't. And yet here I am every day. Acting like I do. Like the fraud I am! I am a fraud. But at least I'm a cool fraud, right? Am I at least a cool fraud? I've been drawing for two hours, my hand hurts. Oh, man. If you need to take a break from drawing, always take a break from drawing. But also, ironically enough, I have also been drawing for almost exactly two hours. Ironically enough. What do you know? How's my fable all of doing? I'm doing just fine. Just drawing some anatomy and and figuring out, you know, where the world's gonna take me. I keep on buffering, send help. How? How? What do you want me to do? Freaking become a little internet parasite, go into my computer and like just waddle my way over to you and kick your kick your router? I I'm sorry, I can't help. I'm over here like what? What do you want me to do? There's only so much I can do. And honestly, there's actually, like, I usually can do nothing. I'm very useless. You should never call upon me in your time of need. Never, ever call upon me in your time of need. I'm gonna stand there extremely confused and be like, What? Huh? Me? That's a mistake, buddy. Y you sure you're calling me? As much as I would love to help, I will not help. I will probably only cause more more chaos on accident, I promise. Just want to say hi because it's been a hot minute. It has been a hot minute. I hope you've been doing good. Hope life's been treating everybody good, honestly. Where is the arm? Okay. Other arm is here. We're going to put it down. The elbow's going to go to about there. Same goes for this arm. Shoulder. Arm down to here. Elbow. Um, I don't know, actually. 
Busy and stressed, over-caffeinated. And over-caffeinated. I thought you were saying you were stressed over-caffeination, and I was like, that's not usually what people are stressed about, but, you know, understandable. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. That's never fun. I do feel you on that, though. Freaking, it is kind of a busy time for a lot of people, I think. Okay. Okay. Um. There we go. That, that could work. That, that could actually work for the arm. Wait, I think that could actually work for the arm. Okay. Or, okay. Yeah, I think this is the better arm, maybe. I want to keep this one. Now I just need to figure out the other arm, which is over here in the red. And it's distracting me because it's over here in the red. I work at a coffee place. Love it, but sheesh. Oh, I can only imagine. I can only imagine. What's funny is for like 16 years, my family and I have been living off internet with a 2006 Apple router that would crash almost every week. Thank goodness we have a new one. What? what are, are you, were you okay? I mean, I feel like I don't have room to talk. Growing up, I couldn't use my phone unless I was in a specific room in the house because of how bad the internet was. I'd have to like go to the freaking office room because that was the only place where the internet was strong enough to really do anything. So I guess I don't really have room to speak, but also, you good? Okay. Maybe I'll just copy this arm and, like, squish it a little. Squish it. Maybe. That might actually work. Maybe up here? But then maybe change where the elbow is. Maybe bring it in further. Maybe. It sucked, nah, bro. Stuck in the past. When I was growing up, we still had dial-up, and I am not that old. <laughs> Dang. Dang. We're, we're all just... Wow. Did you guys know I one time asked my dad if he used to play D&D &D when he was younger? And his response was, You have to remember, we didn't have computers and internet when we were your age. And I was like, D&D &D was originally... Very much not- Okay, you definitely didn't play it. <laughs> I was like, alright, that's a no. Because you don't even- You didn't even know that you- Okay. Yeah. Uh, computers kind of greatly confused my parents. They, they, didn't, they didn't really have computers or games growing up. Although, to be fair, I think they both grew up more like- Farm work to do, so I guess that makes sense. Mm, farm. Okay, oh, that might work. This might be the start of it working, chat. Yeah, I'm gonna turn the. Oh, freaking gosh darn. Alright, I wanted to make the line art black, but instead I just erased it all. Which is not unusual for me, actually. Where's the tail? Where's the gosh darn tail? Where is it? There it is. I'm trying to find it so I could turn it black as well. Okay. Now, we're going to go back to using red. Hmm. Hmm. Let's draw. Probably her hair isn't going to be braided. I could just draw her in her usual outfit, especially if she's struggling, like she's like laying here unable to sleep. It makes sense that you're maybe not changed into any other clothes, so this might work. But I don't know if I want her in braided hair. Probably give her her braided hair. Okay. Well, let's see. A little cog on her cowl would be around here. So then... Goes up to here. No, 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 no. Do it like that, probably. And then... Goes around like that. And then on the other side... Maybe. That might be a little bit too much. A little too far out on this side, actually. Let me erase that. <sighs> I'm going chronically insane. What if you went chronically sane? I don't think you can be chronically sane, huh? Wait, can you be chronically- What if you were so sane that you were insane? Like, you're so normal that it's not normal. What is that called? That's gotta be a thing. Hi, Hatsune. How you doing, baby girl? Like, that's gotta be a thing, though, right? Like, there's no way. I I feel like that that should be a thing at the very least. 
it's the fact that everyone like rejoices when they see Miku in in the stream. It's, she doesn't even leave for that long before getting summoned again. It's like she's been gone for years, and it's like no, no, no. It's it's been like five minutes, chat. She she did not abandon you. She was here just a second ago. Don't don't worry about it. She'll be back. She's always back. The only time Hatsune Miku would not come back is if I removed the Hatsune Miku thing. And I feel like if I removed Hatsune Miku at this point, um, I would be- I would be removed from the internet, somehow. That <laughs> I would not be allowed to come back. Okay. There we go. And then... Okay. Isn't too difficult, maybe. Watch me start struggling now after I've said that. <laughs> I'm like, never mind, guys. I think I'm back. What am I doing? Who am I? Ah! And I cry. I cry, and you guys never see me again. Let's do her hair before her gills. Um. Hmm. I did! I heard that Minecraft is retiring the, the mob vote. I heard that at work. My co worker told me that. I was sitting there doing my job, and then she turns around and goes, They're getting rid of the mob vote. And I went, What? It was a very shocking time in the workplace. Everyone stopped what they were doing and go, what? Like, everybody literally, like, took their headphones off and everything turned around and was like, what? No. No way. For real? For real? That's crazy to me. I didn't really have a thing against the mob vote. I- I get it. Not- it, it's annoying to not get maybe all the mobs or the one that you didn't want wins, blah, blah, blah. But, like, overall, I thought it was kind of fun to have the vote. I liked I liked the vote just because, ooh, who is it gonna be? Oh! And now it's gone. I will admit it's kind of a good thing since it was kind of rigged and it left people sad. I feel like, I'm gonna be so honest, at the end of the day, it's a Minecraft mob. And if it makes you prolong prolonged sadness i'm sorry but it is a minecraft mob <laughs> plus there's a lot of amazing people out there who make modded minecraft and add in not just like maybe mobs we didn't get but like all kinds of other mobs there's so much modded stuff you can get in minecraft that even if you don't get the vanilla mob someone's gonna make that you know elsewhere they said they will add the old votes and never did. Where's my Moo Bloom? I don't know, man. I don't know. I need to sneeze. Thank you! Thank you! Why do I feel like this song is already played today on stream? I don't think it has, but I feel like it has. It could just be that I listened to the song earlier and now I'm confused. Oh, but I'm really struggling. Bless you. Thank you. I'm really struggling with her hair right now. Let's, um, well, her braid is on this side of her hair, so let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I need to pull this up to look at it. So her hair is, like, parted right here. Goes around. Braid is here. All right. Let's see if I can, oh, ha <laughs> yes, speed term. Jump scare! All right. So the braid is kind of started around here. All right try and get this working maybe just a real quick braid I don't know um trying to do this like really fast something like that and what's my most favorite mod like minecraft like modded minecraft um create craft create create craft is that not I don't know the create mod. Create craft. I was thinking of computer craft and create at the same time. I do like computer craft, but I'm not as good at it. But I do like computer craft as well. I have fun with them both. Okay. So, I feel like this strand of hair right here is just throwing me off. Let me see. So it goes, her hair parts kind of on the other side. It goes around. Maybe something like this. Not amazing, but I might just I might just do that for now. It's such an awesome mod, eleven out of ten. It's really fun. Oh, I did not mean to erase all that. 
That was an accident. I was trying to erase a very specific small part. There we go. Hmm. Okay, I'll leave that for now, but I'm not super happy with it. I feel like I could do better. But it's fine. We're gonna have to just live with it. Um. Okay. Let's switch back to red and do her gills in red. Actually, no, let's do her gills in black. So they don't clash too much. Um. One, two, three. This top one's a bit thick. Alright. And then... Actually, delete that. Um, let's have this gill. Like this. Two, a little bit lower. Two. And three. Okay. Eh. Eh, didn't quite. A little, little off kilter with those, I think. Let me see. I always feel like I just make part of the gills or one gill larger than the other. Let's see. There we go. That might be a little bit better. That might be a little bit better. Okay. Hmm. I do not know who Sorbet Shark Cookie is. I'm assuming it's from that um, game where you have cookies. I, I don't know that game though. <laughs> that was really dumb. I'm assuming it's for that game where you have cookies. Also, happy slimes! Let's freaking go! Okay. So, actually, can I stretch that top gill? Maybe. Ooh, it's not really working with me. I'm trying to just stretch the top one. Alright, let's leave it like that. Let's duplicate it. And then put it on the other side, like that. And erase the other two gills, because they're not going to be visible. And just so we know that this is the background gill, I'm going to put the little shading lines on it. Actually bring it down a tiny bit more. So that way I don't get too confused by it. Alright, this is actually kind of coming together. I ain't even going to lie. I ain't even gonna lie, it's actually starting to work out a little bit. I was really struggling with it earlier, but I feel like we are possibly going places. Um, don't take my word for it, though. It's very possible that in five seconds I start crying pathetically and ugly. Got to go, um, got to, wait, got to defeat the dreaded homework. Mm, yeah. Um... I hope you have a wonderful stream and hope to see you again. Thank you for stopping by. Good luck with the homework. I wish you the best of luck. Um, do not die. Stay strong. One day you will be free. That's that's all I can really say. Alright. I will be over here trying to get this anatomy figured out. So we got the tail here. And then we're gonna... Do it like this, I think. Not super happy with that, I don't think, but let me see. Well, hmm. Hmm. I just got rid of all the red. Where did it go? There it is. I thought I deleted it for a second. And I was about to panic. I was like, wait, please. Wait, no. Let's maybe have it go a little bit more straight. Not straight, but like, not as outward i don't know we're trying we're trying folks we're given we're given what we like to call a valiant attempt emphasis on attempt okay all right like that little tears or whatever in her tail because she got blown up unfortunately okay Clean up the sketchiness of it just a tiny bit, because that was very messy right there. Hard to see what was going on. Curve it a little bit more, maybe? Like that. Hmm. Hmm. Squish. Squish it a little bit. And now do that. That might work. I don't know. Maybe the other tail was better. 
I don't know. I'm going to go with this one for now just because it shows more of the tail in the drawing. So we'll just see. Um, I am going to put the hair and gills in a folder. Hide them a little bit. I'm going to try and put it's the body line art. There we go. Put that there. Let's put the tail in there. Wrong tail. Where are the arms? Where are the arms? There they are. I want to see if maybe I should make the body a little bit larger. Maybe. Let's see. Hmm. I think... Do that, actually. I think that helps a little bit. Alright, throw those all in a folder. Move it. Oops! Or the head is not in a folder. Where's the head? Here we go. Here's the face. There we go. Now it's all in a folder. I'm gonna... Let's see. What if we do it like this? Which way? This way. Tilt it a little bit. Just a little bit of a tilt, you know? Just an eensy, teensy, weensy bit. Okay. I want to delete these layers that we didn't end up using. I don't need them anymore. They're just taking up space. All right. I'm actually gonna, where's the, where's the tail? Where did it go? Cause maybe, maybe since I'm tilting it more, it could actually go a little bit more this way. Take up more space. Cause that would be more interesting I think to look at. And that could still serve the purpose of covering up the legs a little bit. Emphasis on maybe, I don't know. Maybe this is not what I want to do, but it's what we're going to try for now. Okay. I'm going to do that. And I am going to squish it a little bit more. And we're going to settle on that and see if that's what we like. See if that's what we like. I'm going to paste it. Make all the line art the same color. All right, so we got our nice rough little sketch right there. I'm gonna mess around with it maybe a little bit more. There we go. Tell you what, hold on, I just forgot something. Um, bed art ref above view. We're gonna go for an art reference. If I could just get an above view look at a bed. Even a sleeping bag would do actually, hold on. Sleeping bag maybe? Uh, that could possibly work as well and it would make sense especially since she is sleeping in the basement so fancy sleeping bag maybe she could have a fancy sleeping bag maybe I feel like she probably would have been given a fancy sleeping bag can I copy this image okay select transform whoa crazy oh i don't know why i made it that big I, like overestimated everything in my life i don't know why i did it that way i think that's probably about the size that you would have with a pillow i think okay let's tilt this as well i think maybe tilt it more maybe position it more in the middle larger you compared to a sleeping bag I don't know I don't know I'm playing the guessing game over here here let's do this let's do that I'm just gonna t trace a sleeping bag I guess wow we look at me go whoa this is crazy this is crazy it's a sleeping bag guys can you believe it this is the legend says that this is like the hardest thing to ever draw a sleeping bag. You must be a truly brave person to attempt this. But don't worry. I am indeed truly brave. You know what I don't like? Pillows. 
They're simple, and yet I also feel like they're, like, not. I feel like they're deceptively simple. Does anyone, like, understand what I'm trying to say right now? They're, they're deceptively simple, but they're not actually simple. I'm actually gonna get rid of that pillow, I feel like. I feel like it's not helping. Um. Hmm. We could actually just pretend this is a bed. We could just straight up pretend that this is a bed. Because if I do maybe like a line right here, I could give the idea that this is up high maybe? Maybe? I feel like I can like lie. I feel like I am like successfully maybe lying. I don't know. I don't know. We'll just go with that. It's fine. I don't... Mm. Uh, oh no. We're just, we just, we're gonna leave it like that. It's fine. It's fine, guys. Don't worry about it. Just putting it in a folder. We're gonna pretend that it's normal. It's fine. Um, I do actually think the tail maybe needs to be different now that I'm looking at this. So hold on just a second. Is there a different tail on here that I could use maybe? Or do I just need to go bald? I might just need to go bald. Okay. Um, copy, paste. Make all this line art black. Or just throw her off the page. Yeah, that too. Throw her right off the page. We don't need her here. Be gone! Alright. So maybe... Let's see. What could we do? What could we do? Oh, My program... Our program said, no, you don't get to draw. And I was like, wait, but I wanna... I said, I put the pencil down, it should be making marks. And it was like, nah, well, it's not gonna. I was like, well, dang. Well, dang. Okay. Okay, that's not really good. Hold on, I'm trying to make it look like if she's on the bed. Whoops, I went back a little too far. So, if her tail goes... We actually might need to untilt her a little bit. Hold on. A little less tilt. There we go. Lay on the bed a little bit more evenly, I guess. I don't know. Shrug. Shrug. Alright, now do this. So, it looks like it maybe falls off the bed and onto the floor. That's the, the look I'm trying to go for, at the very least. I don't know if I'm succeeding. But I am trying. I feel like I didn't succeed in that. Yeah, let me actually do this in red. Red helps me see. I don't know. That's just a me thing. I do a lot of things in red, though. I feel like I do too many things in red. Oh, well. Oh, well. Alright, so if it goes like that. My only thing is, I'm afraid that I won't be able to cover up her legs like I want to. If I do it this way. So I'm trying to find a way where this still covers her legs. Because I just, I cannot fathom how to draw them. But I feel like it's not going to work. I feel like it's not going to work. I mesh transform this better. Squish it a little bit more at the bottom. Because that's what's going to give it that look, I think. Maybe. Maybe. Whoops, now my pencil is too large. My bad, bro. That's on me. Okay. Here, let's just... Well, no, 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 no. Why did I do that? Okay. Let's just leave it like that for now. I'm not sure about it, but let's just leave it like that for now. So, it's definitely better than that tail. That's for sure. Throw that in the folder. Out of curiosity. Yeah, I do think this one's better. So throw that in a folder. Also throw that in that folder. Um, underneath there would just be the floor, I guess. Um. We could do some light shining on the ground, maybe. Just to add some interest. But I don't know. Well, well, you weren't supposed to do that yet. Why'd you do that yet, huh? Thank you. That's that's what I was looking for. Okay. Because my idea is... I don't know if I could finish it in time, but I would like... 
to have a different starting soon screen to kind of keep up with the vibe of Spellbound. And if I did get this finished, I feel like this keeps up with the vibe. I feel like it does. Move it a little bit more into the center so it looks not too off to the side. Um, anything else? I could have things on the ground, but I don't know wanna. I don't know wanna. It feels like a lot of work. Here, go a little bit more onto the bed. How does that look? She's so traumatized. She's so traumatized, guys. Oh, I feel so bad. I feel so bad for her. She's just a traumatized little gal. Okay. Well, let's see. Get rid of the background stuff. Um, I guess we just maybe just start drawing. <laughs> I, I guess this is the part of the stream where we start going for it. Hold on. I want to look at Therm again. I, I do actually like how this has turned out thus far. Still scares the crap out of me. But I do like how it turned out thus far. <laughs> am I scared? Yes. A am I happy with it? Also yes. But I am, in fact, also scared. That That is just that. That is just that. Let's see. Where do I want to start on this? I don't even know exactly where to start on this. There's so much going on here. Oh, well. Oh, I'm gonna make this a little bit smaller. We're just gonna, t we're just gonna give it a good old-fashioned try. We're just gonna give it a good old attempt and see where the world takes us. Well, I already feel like I got taken the wrong way. It's always the eyes. It's always the eyes that get me. Um, let's actually, can I make this more like a diamond shape? I feel like that makes it look more traumatized. I don't know. Something about diamond-shaped eyes makes me be like, hmm, you've been through something, haven't you? you? You've been through something. Yikes. Yikes, indeed. Okay. Do that there. I mean, I feel like her forehead is really, really sharp right here. Now I feel like it's not sharp enough. Oh gosh, there's like no way to get her forehead right. Her forehead, her forehead, her forehead. I can't stop saying her forehead. Her forehead, help her forehead, please. Um. Oh, she is not gonna be wearing goggles in this because I absolutely refuse to draw that right now. I just, I just, I will actually die if I attempt to draw goggles on this drawing. Um, so she's not wearing goggles. Also, I feel like it makes sense not to wear goggles in bed. I just feel like that would be quite uncomfortable. I don't know. Have you ever worn goggles in bed? I guess you could prove me wrong or not, but I feel like I'm not wrong. Man, I can't see her hair clearly enough. <laughs> There's so much going on. There's so much going on, chat. I can't see crap. I drew this and I can't see crap. Send help. <laughs> Send help. I'm also gone southern. Ah! Struggling. 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 Strugg- Th Thank you, Song. Thank you. You're the only thing that's keeping me going. You're so right. I will not let a little thing like Little stop me. I will draw this hair. I will be brave and strong and independent. It's gonna be fine. <laughs> I love drawing, chat. Chat, I am I love being an artist. It fills me with nothing but joy and, and prosperity. It truly is an incredible experience. And if you are not an artist, you should join me in my endeavor. I am not fooling you. I would never fool you. You're gonna have the best gosh darn time of your life. I promise. It's gonna be great. You're, you're never gonna regret anything ever. Never, ever, ever. This is truly the best thing you can do with yourself. It's very fulfilling. And, and, and I'm happy. Oh, shoot, that was wrong. Okay. Whoops. 
Come on. Come on. No. No. Just look. Look right. Look correct. I need you to look like a braid. I don't think it looks like a braid, chat. I feel like it looks like I cried while I did this. And you know what? I think I did. I think I did cry while I did this. So maybe, maybe it's accurate. I was just accurately expressing my feelings as I drew this, this very interesting attempt at a braid. I don't know. I'm just gonna keep, I'm gonna see if I can get it looking like a braid. She has hair, your honor. She's not bald. It's a shocking discovery. Um, but it is a discovery. Curl. Curl. Blink. Blink, I'm begging you. Blink your eyeballs, girly pop! Man. Man, she's not blinking. Okay. I'm sure she'll be fine, chat. But she might not be. How long can you go without blinking before your eyes just, like, stop working? If you never blinked, would you go blind? I don't know how it works. How important is blinking? Just curious. I know that it doesn't feel good to not blink. So, what happens if you just refuse? What happens if you lose your eyelids? Can you lose your eyelids? I'm sure you can. You can lose everything if you try hard enough. Or if you don't try at all. Like, it's pretty- You can lose everything if you try hard enough, chat. Your eyes would dry out and bugs would get on them. Oh, that's nasty! That's disturbing. I guess you're right. Even, like, amphibians lick their eyeballs a little bit. Is it amphibians that lick them? Or is it- Ah. Uh, reptiles. I almost said vegetables. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I couldn't think. I couldn't think of the. Gosh darn it. I couldn't think of the word reptile, but I could think of the word vegetable. Apparently. Well, you know what they say. If you can't remember the word for, for, for reptile, just say vegetable. Because apparently that's the same gosh darn thing. Could you imagine if. if oh. Look at this cucumber. Why does it have eyeballs? That would be so disturbing. I'm sure someone has put googly eyes on a cucumber before, though. That sounds about right, honestly. I'm struggling with this hair. Is it obvious, chat? Is it is it obvious that I'm, like, struggling over here with this hair? I'll figure it out eventually. It's just that I haven't quite figured it out yet. But I'll get there. I'll get there. Uh, there are probably googly eyes on everything. I bet you that there's not a googly eye at the bottom of the deepest part of the ocean. I think I won. I think I won this battle. Not that it was a battle or anything, but if it was a battle, I, I won it. She looks like she has too much hair. I think I gave her too much hair. The fish down there might as well have googly eyes. That doesn't count. I mean human-made. Man-made googly eyes. Don't try and wiggle your way out of this. Don't try to wiggle your way out of this epic defeat I have put you through. It's too late. I win. And you know what I don't win, though? The understanding of this hair. There's a beer bottle down there. Why does that matter? Matter? What did I just say? Mad. Why does that matter? I can't speak English. Are you implying that someone put googly eyes in a beer bottle and then sunk it into the deepest part of the ocean? Are you implying that you're about to do this? Don't put a beer bottle in the deepest part of the ocean. I don't think those sink. I think those wash ashore. Think of- like, there's literally songs about notes and bottles. The bottles aren't sinking. The bottles are going across the ocean. Because it means one day there could be a googly eye down there. Who in their right mind is gonna put a googly eye in a beer bottle and then sink it in the ocean? That's not a thing anyone's gonna do. 
And if they do that, I'm confused. Hi, I won at therapy. Are we winning at art? Maybe? Here, Fish, I want your opinion on this uh, sketch I've got right here. Are we winning? Do you think this is winning? Do you think if there was like a Twitch chat box like right here we'd be winning? Why can't I draw this square? That was really difficult. And I don't know why. She's not winning. She's not winning in the slightest. Fish, I want a brain rot spellbound so bad. Why did I just click that on and off multiple times? Send help. I did not mean to do that. Um, girl is not sleeping. She's not sleeping. But does that surprise anybody, honestly? Does it? The mother she's been sleeping with <laughs> has not been her mom. That's terrifying to learn. Oh, there's term. There's term. It's the fact that it's so close up. Oh my goodness. Okay, hold on. I'm trying to figure out. Um, I'm really trying to figure out her hair right now. Okay, so it's like this, maybe? I'm trying to get this to look good. And it just doesn't want to work with me. How dare. How dare. I might just go with that. That might be good enough. Um, where's the braid? Braid is over here. I'm gonna actually leave the bottom part of the braid alone because I just don't know where the hand is gonna be. And I don't want to mess with that later, so. Let's do these, these beautiful gills. Wow. Wow. Well, immediately I messed up. Wow. I love that drawing Goldie's gills is just draw a straight line and then, like, chew. Chew the gills up. Hello, Spooky. How you doing? How you doing? I'm waiting for Stark to come back from the war, a.k.a. ads. <laughs> Starf! Did you survive the ads? I missed you. I missed you a lot. Did you live? Guys, I think we lost a good one today. I think we lost we a good one. We woo indeed! I love Goldie's braid, but the context makes it sad. I know, I know. The thing is, her braid is so pretty on her too. Like, this is a really good hairstyle for her. I love this look on her, but I hate how we got there. I returned from the ads, I learned about the new robot man. Oh! What? The utter confusion that just went through my, my entire body. Starf, do you agree that Goldie's braids look really nice on her, but they're absolutely depressing when you know that a demon braided her hair that she thought was her mom? Yeah. Oh, the Astrobot game. I was so confused. I was like, you learned about what? <laughs> what? Wait, what? Okay. It looks so good on her, but for what? The price we had to pay was great, chat. It was a large, large price. It is unfortunate. But it is true. But it is really pretty on her. I really do like it. Oh, I have another sketch of it, actually. Hold on. Let me pull up the first sketch I made. So, for some context, when I decided that Goldie should have braided hair, I drew a sketch. I then waddled in disguise DMs and I went, for science... Would the demon know how to braid hair? <laughs> well, I didn't say that. I said, would SB Sky know? But we all know what we're really saying here. And Sky said, yes. And I sent this image. And I said, perfect. Please braid hair. <laughs> and then, and then I got what I was hoping. Yay! And then Goldie's life fell apart. So... That's, that's unfortunate, but this is the sketch I sent to Sky to be like, pretty please, can I get Goldie's hair braided? Pretty, pretty please. And then, and then it happened. And then Goldie found out that that's not her mom. Wow. 
It's crazy. Real crazy, real crazy times. I don't know if those are the best gills, but we're just gonna go with it. We're just gonna go with it for now. I might redraw them later. Let's see her clothes are actually really hidden. Um, dang, dang. It's like here, up to here, and then back well, over her shoulder. It's always fun drawing Goldie because they're always changing. Goldie is such an ever-changing character. Like, you've, you've caused me distraction now. We're going through it. We're going to pull up Goldie's, like, forms of existence, okay? Because Goldie is such an ever-changing character. I'm actually going to pull up the recent um, kid Goldie art I made because that's a really good drawing. So let me pull that up real quick. It's, uh, it's right here. I don't have to go far to find it. Okay. Copy this. We're just going to do new via clipboard. So here we have little baby Goldie. Look at her. Please. Look at her eyes. She's a little baby Goldie. I love her so much. So, so much. Anyways, my baby. Yeah, Goldie had, she wasn't grown into her gills yet. Okay. All right. Like, look at her now, a little more proportionate. This was like the size of her head. She, look at her tail. It was huge. She's just a baby. Look at her chubby arms. Guys, look at her chubby arms. I cannot. Look at, look at her. She 100% had the most pinchable cheeks. Look at her chubby arms. Sorry, that's, that's my favorite part. She had the most chubby little arms. I love it. I love it so much. I cry. I cry all the time. Anyways, you ask what did they do to her? Freaking a lot. So much. They did so much. I cry. I cry. Um, man, I have so much Goldie art, you guys. It's not even funny. It's not even funny how much Goldie art I have. Um, let's see. So, we obviously have... Where? I have a specific drawing I'm looking for. Okay. Whoopsies. We obviously... Blah, 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 blah. We obviously have little itty bitty baby Goldie. Um, I guess this is the same as little itty bitty baby Goldie, but I'd say she's like, this is when she was a little bit older. She had the hair that was starting to grow in. She wasn't, um, bald. <laughs> it's cute though. It's cute. The fact that little itty bitty baby Goldie was bald is actually so funny to me, but in like a cute way, you know, in a cute way. Um, but yeah. And then she also went through, we cannot forget her angsty stage, um, where she was also dressing exactly like her mom. <laughs> really just decided to be a carbon copy of her mom. When you put her baby form next to her older one, she looks so bald. <laughs> 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 oh, sorry, it's term. <laughs> How does this become this? Sorry about the term jump scare. I apologize. I really apologize. How? Look at this. Guys. Guys, I'm so sad. I'm actually so very sad. Life is nothing but pain and agony. Did you know? Did you know? I cry a lot. Look at that! The light in her eyes is like completely gone. Y'all, someone messed this child up. Yeah, very much so. Sorry, I was popping my neck. If you heard that, I'm not sorry. Um... Ugh. It's so unfortunate. Um. <laughs> Do we have any other stages of Goldie that I could pull up right here? 
Um, oh, I forgot about this. Ooh! Angsty! Yeah, she went through a time. Girl, your eye is not looking good. Dang. Where's Goldie's soul gem? They aren't wearing it anymore. That's why she's got... Freaking, where am I? Freaking, the, ah! That's why she's got this pouch right here. Um, she doesn't like wearing it. She doesn't like seeing it. Uh, for anyone who doesn't know, Goldie doesn't even like seeing her gem. But she has to keep it on her. But she's got the pockets here. Yeah. She, she does not like her soul gem, but she knows that she needs it. But it, for her, it's just a reminder, you know? So, not a fan. Every freaking time! Term! I will close this file. I'm closing it. It's gone. No more term jump scares. It's gone. Oh my gosh, I'm also closing this. <laughs> I was so done getting term jump scared. Um, let's see, do we have anything more? Wait, you know what I want to do? Hold on. Hold on, we're going to my art folder. Going to my thumbnails. No, we needed it. Mm -mm, it's gone. It's gone. Goldie's first ever thumbnail that she was a part of. And then... Oh! Oh, no! I'm in pain, chat. One, the art growth is incredible. But also, this is so sad. I love the art growth, though. That's, this is like a year of difference. This is a one year difference, basically. Because I think Goldie has been a character for about a year now. I think. Can I, like, see when this first drawing of Goldie was made? Is this a thing I can do? Hold up, I'm trying to pull up a file. Um, I like look in the properties. Okay, this drawing of Goldie says that it was created Sunday, July thirtieth, twenty twenty three, at eight twenty four p.m. So Goldie is a little over a year old character wise, I think. Um. But I did make Goldie before she existed. Everyone who's drawn Goldie has had, like, crazy growth. I know, right? Man. It's, it's, the, it's the Goldie gift, you know? Hold on. Can I look at the thumbnail of Goldie and see if that's got a time on it to see? Wow, that was a, that was a fun sentence. Oh, uh, where is it? Where is it? First thumbnail of Goldie. Let me find it. Here it is. Properties. This was created Monday, August 14th, 2023. 12 in the morning. Um, what does that mean? She is over a year old now, right? What? Okay, August. What month is it? September? Goldie is a, oh, dang. Goldie's one-year-old birthday was a few weeks ago or a month ago. Goldie's one-year-old birthday from her introduction to Spellbound. Not her creation, but her first introduction to Spellbound. Um, because that was gonna be- that was Sunday. This says that it was created Monday, August 14th, meaning that her first time to ever appear as a character was Sunday, August 13th. Which was a month ago? No, a year- a month and a year ago. A year and a month ago. Meaning that Goldie, hold on, I'm deep diving, I'm deep diving. I'm deep diving real quick. I'm pulling up my calendar. Meaning that Goldie turned one. Let's see. Goldie turned one on August. Technically, she turned one on a, a Tuesday. So let's say that the Spellbound after would have been, so that would have been August 18th. And that was, okay, one, two, three, four spellbound, spellbound streams ago. And if we pull up YouTube and go check out our Spellbound VODs and count backwards, give me just a moment to get there. 
That was four VODs ago, I believe. I might double check real quick, though. But I think it was. Here, I'm pulling up my calendar one more time to double check. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Wait, is it gonna be the fourth or, sorry, I'm confused. I'm trying to figure this out. I'm being like a detective and I'm not a detective. Okay, episode eight, seven, six, five. Episode five would have been the episode where we could have technically celebrated her birthday. And that was the, ep that was the last episode where Goldie kind of had a chance that was the episode I actually drew Goldie looking a little bit happy because Flam said that was my last opportunity. Um, however, we could also argue that episode four is closer to her birthday since it was technically on a Tuesday, which is two days after. What happened in episode four and what happened in episode five? Hold on. I'm, I'm pulling them up real quick. Wait. Okay. I think... Oh, episode four was the week after the explosion. Because Goldie didn't have goggles for a while in this episode, and then she was given goggles. <gasps> that almost makes Goldie's new goggles a birthday present. Oh. Oh. Well, this is the same episode where she was getting pretty mad at Ublek and feeling suspicious of him. And then episode five, which is another episode we can argue as, like, close to her birthday, um, was... What happened this episode? Oh, man. That was when Term was gone, right? Term went missing. Term went away for a week. <gasps> I have the saddest thing to say. No. I'm taking this to the Spellbound... I'm taking this... I'm taking this to the Spellbound Sphere general. Okay, I have done a deep dive in how long Goldie has existed um, since her quote-unquote birth in, in Spellbound. Um, Term missed her birthday. Yeah! Term missed her birthday! I, I think everyone did, technically. Technically, we could have had a Goldie birthday, but it's fine. Um, so, Goldie's first episode was um, August. August. Hold on, I have to double check this real quick in the properties. It was August 13th. 13th. Meaning her one-year-old birthday, birthday happened four weeks ago, um, on a Tuesday. Meaning canonically she had her birthday after her mom was blown up and her dad was missing for a week exclamation mark i'm gonna double check this before somebody looks at this and then fact checks me and proves me wrong it was one two three four no no, no five weeks ago it's five weeks ago okay there's my fact check reason five weeks ago which was episode one two three four five who's a friend who's a foe episode it was this episode which ended with her dad not coming back home all right then a deep dive in how long goldie has existed since her birth in spellbound so goldie's first episode was august 13th meaning her one-year-old birthday happened five weeks ago on a tuesday i misspelled tuesday for some reason meaning canonically she had her birthday after her mom was blown up and her dad was missing i'm just gonna add just was currently missing was currently missing meaning canonically all right i need to fix my spelling of tuesday but i don't know what i did wrong 
I'm just gonna retype it. Tuesday. All right. Meaning her one-year-old birthday happened five weeks ago on a Tuesday. Um, had her birthday a week after her mom was blown up and her dad was currently missing. All right. <laughs> I did a deep dive. I did a deep dive. And I feel so bad. I feel so incredibly bad. I'm going to add. But hey, she's over a year old now. All right. Hey, chat, how do we feel about that? Hey, chat, how do we feel? <laughs> I, I'm i currently in feeling sad. Anyways, Goldie, I've grown so much in my art since I first started drawing Goldie, though. I am really proud of it. This is really not a bad drawing at all. I don't know why I didn't do more with it. <sighs> what if I explode? That's so sad. It's so sad. Um... Man. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Did not mean to shrink that. That was a little oopsies on my part. Man, Goldie... Ugh. She's so tragic. She's so tragic, chat. Goldie is so tragic. For why? For why? I mean, obviously for the, for the drama. But also, for why? She's just a tragic little gal. Living her tragic little life. Doing her tragic little things. It's fine. It's fine. Um, sometimes you're just a character with nothing but trauma and trauma and trauma and trauma. Man. Man. That's so unfortunate. She could have had a birthday. I love that technically she, she spread... Oh my gosh, wait. Does that mean she spread the rumor of Newt's birthday, a, like, a few days after her own birthday? Because isn't that what she did? Is that what she did in episode- No, no, no. Episode- Okay, episode five, the week after her birthday, technically, was when she decided to spread a rumor the next week about Newt's birthday. Ha! <laughs> Imagine it being your birthday, but you don't even realize it. Um... And you decide to spread a rumor about somebody else having a birthday. And then they basically get their not really birthday birthday kind of celebrated. And you don't even realize that it's technically been your birthday. Because you don't know exactly when you were born. And your parents are a little too busy being uh, blown up slash a demon and uh, missing. <laughs> That's so depressing! I love it! Man. The deep dive I didn't know we needed, chat. The deep dive I didn't know we truly, truly needed. Ugh. She's so tragic. Goldie's like my favorite character. She did grow ten times the speed of her own life. You said she's like 12-ish in Axolotl years. This is true. Um, she did grow pretty rapidly fast, but life-wise, like she's been sentient for a year. It's like if you were, like, a freaking... What, what was freaking the Superboy clone? That was the sound of me ripping a tag off my blanket. <laughs> I don't know why I decided to do that just now, but it was really bugging me, and now it's gone. Um... <laughs> oh, no. The Superboy clone! The sound of me destroying something. Sorry, guys. Just destroyed the Superboy clone. My bad. Sorry, guys. Um... It's kind of like... I don't know. His situation? He was, like... An older, he, like, physically was older, but then it's like, but you've only been alive technically for a few months. Whoa. I don't know. Something like that. Man, this, this is going to try and give me a fit, isn't it? This is going to try and confuse me. I'll figure it out. I believe in myself. I believe in myself. Well, I'll tell you what. We're not finishing this today. And I don't know if I'll finish this in time for the next Spellbound episode, but I think it'll be a fun little art piece to work on as life goes by. We are about near the end of stream. I feel like at this point we just need to be chatting. I feel like it's also what we have been doing anyway, so. Uh, now I'm thinking about how she said she wasn't a kid anymore. Girl, you are a baby. <laughs> 
she doesn't really consider herself a kid because, I mean, yeah, she grew up rapidly fast, and also her life was being threatened a lot. You, that, that ages you. That ages you, my man. I do feel very bad for her, though. I do, I do, I do. Poor thing. I actually know who we're gonna raid, though. I think Term is live. I'm, like, pretty positive Term is live, but I'm maybe I'm wrong. Let me go see. Is, is Term live? Yes. Term is live. I am correct! I am correct! Oh, my ankle just popped. Term jump scare. What if we just... <laughs> Why don't we just make the raid message term jump scare? No, we're not, but it would be kind of funny. We did get a lot of term jump scares today. I'm actually going to save this real quick, because I think I would like to send this to term. Let me just put maybe SB term. If I can get my pencil tool, dang, man. S B term. He's having a bad time. He's having a bad, bad time. There we go. <gasps> PT! Hi! Thank you for the for the resub for six months! Hello. How you doing? I know you guys are sitting in the live laugh trauma. I see you. I see you. We're actually about to raid term right now, so this is a good timing. I'm actually just saving this SB term drawing and looking at it and going, Man, I feel bad for that dude. Man, I feel bad for that dude. Alright, let's save this as um, SB term sketch. I misspelled sketch. There we go. Now sketch is spelled correctly. I've done it. Alright. It is saved! Aha! So we got this drawn. Did we draw anything else? Yeah, it was just this. We got this drawn. Uh, we got this in the works. So, you know, it was a little bit of a productive day. It wasn't too bad. I mean, I, I was a little distracted today, but, you know, I think I struck out pretty good. Got some work done. So we're going to get a raid up and running now. I'm going to raid Terminian Link VT. There is the raid, everybody. Join the raid. Join it now or suffer the consequences of my s disappointment. I, I, just, just my disappointment. Anyways, raid message is screen in all caps. If you're a sub, you can use the screen emote. If you're not sub, that is totally fine. Just say screen. Gets the point across perfectly. I will be live again on Thursday. Hopefully, my Wi-Fi will be better by then. I'm going to try and get in contact with the Wi-Fi company because it is, like, progressively getting worse and I'm not happy about it. I mean, I can still stream, but I have a feeling that if, if it's just going to keep getting worse and we're not going to want to get to that point. So... I'm gonna fingers crossed that I can contact my Wi-Fi company and get it fixed, everybody. And as long as everything works out, I will be live again Thursday. Fingers crossed. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you everyone who lurked, raided, followed, etc. etc. I appreciate it so so much. Make sure you're in that raid, give Term some love, support, and appreciation. And as always, until next time, bye-bye.